Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. For the second time today, this is Keeper Tesla, and happy April Fool's Day, everyone. <laughs> we were going to do something else today, something really actually funny, but uh, Delmar put this, planted this seed inside my head, and I've been thinking about not, you know, I haven't played Silent Hill Shutter Memories, my second favorite Silent Hill game in the series, since the summer of 2021, which is the longest since it's been. <laughs> since it's been. And... Uh, yeah, I can breeze through this game in one sitting, I'm fairly sure. it's. Uh, if you're not familiar, Shattered Memories is a reimagining of the very first Silent Hill game, which means it takes the same characters and themes, but does them in a completely different way, and the twist is completely different, and man, does it work for me. It didn't work for a lot of people, but it really goes with the... Uh, with the psychological horror instead of the, the boo horror, <laughs> you know. So, I love this game. And we're gonna do it. Hey, Mutation, did you recognize that voice? Yeah, that music, it's so good. It's music of Silent Hill, Akira Yamoka. Mwah. But, uh, I guess I chased her away. But, <laughs> um, that was, that's the voice of Alex Wesker, Mary Elizabeth uh, McGlynn, that uh, I always rave about when we're playing Resistance. That's the same lady. She voices Alex Wesker and she did vocals in Silent Hill games in Silent Hill 3 for the music. And just a very, <laughs> very remarkable singer. But let's get into it. We're going to do, so this game, as you might, might have seen the warning, if you're not familiar, it psychologically profiles you as you play. It studies your choices and then builds the rest of it based on that of course it's got limitations but for 2009 games is amazing and i think it deserves a remake with uh, today's hardware and to prove that silent hill can be more than just a cult you know uh so uh i'm gonna go the, the endings of course of course there's four endings with uh, many variations so there's in essence many endings <laughs> but four main themes I'm just gonna go and do the quest, and I, as far as I remember, like, just trying to find your daughter is, uh, one of the endings. Let's say the best, but also the saddest. Let's get into it. No damage, yeah. Well, no damage in this game, you know that. It's a, it's a very different Silent Hill game. And that rubbed a lot of people the wrong way. Like I said, I gotta say, I gotta, I gotta say it out loud. Not me, though. I love this game. Adore it. Played it so many times. One more time. For good luck. I, I want more Climax Studio Silent Hills, really. They made two excellent games. I love my daddy. Gavin. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh, chills me to the bone. It's a Wii game ported to the PS2, so it's amazing how it works. And it shows, really, the game was built with Wii gimmicks, which is one of the reasons that <laughs> pushed a lot of people away. I think Senpai, my friend Senpai Trash TV, said it the best when he said, Oh, can I shake a key out of a can game? <laughs> can I solve this puzzle? <laughs> but yeah, the puzzles are... Puzzles are Wii-ish. You know, adapted to the controller, they're still silly. But it's the story of the game that keeps it going the atmosphere the shots <laughs> two times indeed Gavin man you've been up almost as long as I have it's a one of the very few widescreen ps2 games very few few not very few Yes? The new patient is here. They're early. That's fine. We can start now. Yeah, let me know if the game's too loud, louder than me. I Last time I streamed this, I had a different setup, so I did some testing today. And, uh, yeah, if it's too loud... Or if I'm too loud. Here's 
It's the premise is the same. You're Harry Mason looking for your daughter Cheryl. Adopted daughter Cheryl. I'm in the original. Your name. Just turning up shows your commitment to the process. Good. I've read your notes. The other therapist didn't work out for you. I want you to know this will be different. We take this at your pace. No notes, no drugs, no theories. We go back to the start, understand what happened. Take a look at this short form. I promise it's the only one you'll see during your therapy. We're gonna go with random answers? Try to answer truthfully. It's easier. We've been done truthfully many times. So let's go. One, two, two, one, 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 two. Let's see what kind of Harry we get. <laughs> You've been unfaithful. Is that true? Well, I mean, if I said so okay. on the four. Let's get started then. Let's. <clears throat> Cheryl. Cheryl, sweetie. Oh, my God. My best friend, my flashlight. Cheryl? Or torch. Cheryl? 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 Hello, as long as it's not Sarah. <laughs> Cheryl? Yeah, you can call, you can look at things, and the game notices what you look at. And he reacts to things you look look at, so. Sweetie? You can call her. Cheryl. And I do mean <clears throat> whatever you look at, because if you look at things like this, hey. he reacts and the game notices. And it really affects it how your game's gonna play out. You can try. Come on. Nine one one. Phone's out. Yeah, you don't even have to interact with stuff. Restroom? Was there? Wasn't there like a sign? Yeah, there we go. Stuff like that. But we're not gonna look at that. Because we're just going to look for Cheryl. This is just me demonstrating. Yeah, I can't stop myself. <laughs> no, no, no. Just fuck it. Where's Cheryl? Cheryl. Cheryl. All right, game. I think I can open the door. I've done this in my life. See why it's a Wii kind of game. There's no puzzle, it's more like, oh, could you do this, but with a controller instead. Zdravo, Nina, zdravo, zdravo. Šta radite tamo, devojke? E, mama, ako možda ispratiš ovo, bi ti si svidjelo da smo gledali ovo kao film. Šta mi radi, Nina? Where are we gonna go? Sometimes we have two paths, but I'm looking for my daughter. I'm just gonna go. Here it says it's open. Cheryl? She could be in here. Cheryl. Where was that? Somewhere out. 
Oh yeah, all right. Gotta open the door. Answer the phone, you bastards. I just found out about the tape. That was our only copy. The happiest day of my life and you wiped over it. I'm not letting this slip. Yeah, this also changes. So the the puzzles change. They they also adapt to, you know, as as much as they can to whatever you did. Cheryl. Don't forget to buzz, okay? Wait it. We open the door. And there are many side stories that belong to the town of Silent Hill. But you know, as we played this many times uh, <laughs> for the story marathons, if you missed it last time, there's always gonna be another Shattered Memory stream. Was it this way? Yeah. Look, there's no yellow tape to tell me where to go, cause I'm s the game acknowledges I'm smart enough to know what's climbable. Can you believe that? Same ste, oh, pa lepo se provedite. Lepo se provedite, devojke. Was it this way? Yeah. Gonna need a key. I'm gonna react to that. It's a sign. All right, we need the key. Can't do anything there. No, don't jump over it. Dead dog. <laughs> It's a reference to the first Silent Hill. <clears throat> or even third. Could you solve this puzzle, huh? <laughs> That's what John was raving on about. <laughs> I understand how this made sense on the Wii, but man. Oh, sometimes it's in, it's in a different can. <laughs> how can you ever do this properly? Yeah, we could start the uh, UFO run, though. I forgot about that, but we're not going to do it. Diner or tavern? You know, when I have choices at any moment, if anybody wants to jump in, I'm going to go for the diner. I think we, yeah, because of the choices we made so far, we locked out the tavern part anyway. Oh, look at her. So, char support character's appearance changes with your decisions. She's got a several looks. She's got several looks she can adopt, based on what you do. I need your help. Car stuck in the snow. Need help dethawing your windshield. It's my daughter. She's missing. She run off. We were in a car accident. When I came to, she was gone. Car accident. And where did this happen? The highway, just outside town. I came off the verge and ended up in the junkyard. My daughter's missing. That road's not in my jurisdiction. Wow, she's really bitchy. Police. I've never had her like this. My daughter is out there. You have to find her. A lot of people need help tonight. Look around. The whole town is a mess. You're screwing with me. Can I see your license? Wow, Sybil. Nice. I like when I play, play different like this. Terry Mason. Levin Street. Says here you live on Levin Street? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Sure hope you weren't drinking before you had your crash. Oh my god, the way she's looking at me. Look at her Look. straight in the eye. Chances are your girl headed home, right? It's only a few blocks away. <laughs> Sir? You gonna answer your phone? Phone? Yeah. Hung up. That was probably your girl. The storm's making the phones act up. All units, please respond. Unconfirmed reports of a potential looting on Finney Street. Okay, I gotta go. What? Look. You just left home. him. Your daughter will be there. In the morning, call state police and sort out your vehicle. <laughs> no time for running around town. Liable All right. yourself locked up. That's me asking nicely. Wow. 
damn, I, I saw this look of hers in a screenshot, but I never had her act like this. She's usually either kind or more like direct with him, but not like this. Not like not not as insolent. All right, we got a phone. We can save our game and do shit in that. So all right, let's do what she said. Not even gonna get the mementos. Cause all I want to do is find my daughter. Shit, I should know where I am. What is wrong with me? Back the way I came. Please be there. So for me, it's a little special as well because. I play. Uh, I played this game um, in 2000, winter 2012, 11, 12, and it was one of the biggest blizzards. Like almost this tall snow outside my house, so we were snowed in for days, and this was a perfect game to spend it with. So it kind of feels the game was made in 2009 for the and ha occurs in 2008. Takes place in 2008, so. Uh, it's more modern than the other Silent Hills. What was it? Up on the deep dark? Uh, it was left, maybe? That's map. I know there's a short... Right. There you go. Daddy, help me. That was brief. You got a helper? Back the way we came, all right? Strong emotions have a habit of ta attaching themselves to objects. Something in this room is interfering with Harry's cell phone. So yeah, memories of other people can... Uh, for who you are and the way you are. Our marriage will be a source of strength so you can go into the world and achieve great things. I am your muse and your best friend, but I will be much more. I will be your wife. All right, so yeah, a couple of variations on that as well. So that's the tape that was erased that was mentioned earlier in the message. Here we go, time for a nightmare. I love the introduction of this. Home, oh my. Cheryl? Daddy? Daddy? Sweetie, you're okay? Are you at home? Sweetie, wait there, wait for me. You have to run, Daddy. You can't fight them. Run! What? Is somebody with you? Cheryl? I'm coming to get you! Damn it! Here we go, the way- Oh, I love this. The whole city's going crazy. Things freezing over. Breaking apart, look at that. It's broke the whole town. Ljubka, zdravo Ljubka! Baš mi je žao što si šao da propustiš, ali bit će mnogo još ovog Silent Hill-a. Tvoj bata mnogo voli ovu igru. Let's see what kind of monsters we get. Because that also depends on the... on how you play the game. Now I pluck it. Bitch. time yeah we can do that you can't fight them you gotta run you gotta avoid them at all cost
They're called nightmares here, if I remember correctly, yeah. Run! Shit, shit, shit. Alright, you can hide in lockers too, which is rarely really useful. But you can also take these down and slow them down. Oh shit, 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 shit. They are many, they cannot be killed or hurt. Throw them off and run. Lose them, find the exit and escape the nightmare. That's right, the nightmare. Fuck, 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 fuck! But I gotta check the map occasionally to see where the fuck I am. Gotta find the exit. Which makes it harder if you're being chased. Close the map, D-pad left. Oh shit, they're coming, they're coming! Shit, shit, shit. Come on. Alright, I'll get a flare here, yep. Alright, I'm remembering. If they get too close, I burn them, like right now. You'll even dare to slow them down. Oh, I hope I'm not repeating. Shit, shit. She's already behind me. There we go, I made it. Alright. And then, just like that, it's all normal. There's a house. It's good that we touched on the car crash. That would have been a breakthrough before. But let's leave that topic for a while. I want to talk about family. It's important, right? I don't mean all that touchy-feely crap. You're not a very touchy ah, person. Ah, already forming an opinion about me based on my answers. Give me that look. I'm talking too much. Well, let's have you talk or not or whatever you feel comfortable doing. Let's play true or false. Is it true to say you're a private person? Uh, sure. Would you say it takes a while for people to get to know For you? people to get to know you? Nah. Uh -huh. I'm a grumpy. <laughs> people can choose their friends, but not their family. Would you prefer to spend time with friends over family? Let's say no. Nothing surprising there. No. You're going to like this. On the table are some pencils and a picture. I want ah, yeah. you to let out your inner child and color in the picture. It's titled Happy Family. All right, so this just basically changes the game. How you draw the, how you paint the house. That's what it's gonna look like in the in the game. So let's just be let's just be weird about it. What's the weirdest color to put on the house? Lime green. Yeah, imagine a lime green house. There you go. We're gonna give him what is this purple purple pants <laughs> and uh she can have yellow pants with a brown top just like this wooden part no i'm gonna paint different door can be brown brown we're just basic stuff let's make the car light blue just basic stuff. You don't really have to detail it because the game will take that and make something out of it no matter what you do. Let's say with a black bumper and a red stripe. That's a, that's a really, that looks like their car. Let's say orange-ish roof. A really, there you go. The orange behind the trees, why not? Green trees, boop, boop. There you go, brown, brown behind, also brown, no, there. The steps, also brown, I like brown steps, look at that. It's the best steps you've ever seen. Let's give him, what kind of, same color as the car shirt, let's see. 
what they're gonna look like. This is good enough. You're finished. Yes, I finished. What a lovely family home. Is your home like this? Ah, look at that. It looks just like I drew it with the car and everything. <laughs> It's, I think it's dripping. Yeah, water. Oh my god. Are you okay, son? No. With the shit and everything. What are you people doing in my house? Cheryl! Easy there. This isn't your house. Some trouble, honey? No, Lucy. This man here is just a little confused. <laughs> this is my house. Well, I don't see how that can be the case. We've been here nearly 14 years. Sure you got the right address? Who was that? That was our daughter, Katie. You're in a bad way, son, getting yourself all worked up. Are you okay? I am not okay. I was in a car accident. My daughter is gone, and you people are in my house. This is all wrong. You're starting to make a scene. <laughs> this doesn't make sense. Not at all. Cheryl! You are upsetting my wife. Get the hell out of my house. It's my house. Get out. My damn house. Cheryl! Man, aren't you wondering why they painted their house green? It's like uh, it's like that episode with uh, Bugs Bunny and the uh, Deaf Duck when uh, Deaf's life is being redrawn around him. Just driving him crazy. <laughs> Free Sun Hill PD. Mr. Mason. Hmm. Shit. Shit. A reported disturbance came through on dispatch. The address rang a bell. No, I Has rang the bell. Been a disturbance? <laughs> there are people in my house. I think they have my daughter. Hell of an accusation. I know the couple who called this in. Mike Stewart is a doctor. He doesn't have your... You saw my license. This is my house. Let me see that license again. You had an accident. You know you're a little punch drunk, Harry. Punch drunk? I can't raise the station on my radio. Let's go over there together and sort this mess out. Look, I'm sorry if I came across as a hard ass. Oh, There's look at that. What's going on right now? I just bumped you up on my priority list, okay? Come on. Where's she all nice? What did I do? Mind your head. Like. Five guys get out of there and beat the shit out of them with sticks. <laughs> Don't worry, everything will... This, like, because not the whole conversation, you pieces of the funny? conversation I've been a cop are changing. For 20 years. Before that, I used to ride around in my daddy's patrol car, so I know the town, There's know the house. people. But your face? I don't know you. I keep out of trouble. Not huh. tonight. Is that a nice H1? Well, I guess reference? tonight everything is out of whack. Why are we the only car on the road? No one's safe Why are you? driving tonight. Sorry, I didn't mean to. It's okay. I did hear pieces of this conversation. What is with all this snow? Who knows? We only covered basic meteorology in the academy. Hell, we didn't hear about this till it was happening. Barely had time to close off the major highways. Like the whole town is being punished. It's only weather. Sure. Nice conversations. Yeah, so I was gonna say, just parts of conversation can change, not the whole thing. So it can shuffle bits and pieces into a different story. Different, you not so different, but you know. Sure. Holding up. I'm sure your daughter's okay. We've just gotta clear this thing up. We should probably get you to the hospital too, once we know she's safe. I'm fine. The human brain is a delicate thing, Harry. Need to get you checked out. Yeah. My dad thought he was tough. He got hit on the head by a punk resisting arrest. He was never the same after that. You gotta look after yourself, Harry. For your daughter's sake. Point taken. 
Well, that's an awful convenient blizzard. For Lupka! Kapla! Right? I'm just gonna get out of here. I'm perfectly. That's natural. Oh no, she locked me in. She locked me in like I'm some kind of criminal. Let me go up ahead. I'm sure the front door can be unlocked. Nope. There must be some kind of a child lock here. Oh yeah, there you go. I grew grew over these a long time ago. Was there something here? No, don't move. Let's see. One memento. One memento for Lupka. It's the it's a pack of. This town is home to many lost and discarded objects. Although these mementos have no practical value or purpose, they once meant something to someone. We got a pack of Hemingway Ultralights. It's a reference to Silent Hill 3, in which it was a reference to Hemingway, I guess. <laughs> Next 10 miles. What was it? Oh yeah, I gotta jump over. That's right. I'm running in the woods in the night. In the night. Something about the phone. Mom, it's Jackie. I've been stupid. I've come out into the woods for a party, but I want to come home. Uh, I'm lost. I don't know where I am. I'm outside a ranger station. I don't like the crowd here. I want to come home. Huh. This also changes. But yeah, I assume now, like, when I try these different alternative play styles, I'll hear new shit. Not gonna look. You can look, like I said, you can look pretty much in anything and you'll, like, have a comment. I think if you look at the bed, you'll be like, oh. Town is to the east. There you go. Gonna need a key. Gonna need a key now. Wait. Aha. Uh -huh. All right. Oh, could you solve this puzzle? I don't know. Like it's better than any other Silent Hill puzzles I've ever seen. Nothing can compare. <laughs> but it's like I said. It's 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 a story game in essence. A story game with a lot of replay value. I know there are some events left and right, but there's we'll get this one. I remember this one here. It's definitely there. Oh, it's just a, another memento. Frozen waters. I think it's a reference to again Silent Hill 3, but also to birth. I think. Don't hold me to it. The flashlight will tell us when there's something weird, like now. Just find the source. Another one? Oh, there it is. Don't worry about looking for me. I'll be with my brother again soon. I hope he forgives me. It's so cold. I had it had to end like this. Yeah, a lot of grim stories in this game in the background. If you if you're willing to look for them, which does relate to the main story. In the end, it makes sense with all the mementos and all the little stories. In the end, it actually makes a sense. It makes some sense. We're taking a little detour, and because you have a phone, you can always like if you see a number somewhere, you can always try like. First thing, I been fishing since I was a kid. You should call nine nine one one for instance. But any phones you see on the posters around you are also v valid, and you can call and get different responses. They won't solve your problem, but it's interesting in the ways they don't get to help you.
my daughter. Okay, I'm going to hang up now. No, wait. Shit. Or the the number we see here, five five five, three four seven four. No wait, delete. So what was that? The Rangers? State Department of Natural Resources. The operations center is closed right now. If you are calling for information regarding the upcoming con Okay, we don't need you. But yeah. More maps. I see. I see. I didn't understand the word. We thought it would be fun to spike the new girl's drink. Didn't know it would end up like this. We thought she was still swimming, but she wasn't moving. Oh my god, this one's... Wow! Okay, I've never had this one with this photo either. But, whoa, gee! Alright, happy, happy April Fool's Day, everyone. <laughs> Welcome to the horror. It's really nice when the frame rate goes up and it's most visible without the light Wait, where's the light button triangle yeah without the light it's way more stable i guess the ps2 had issues with rendering the light and the game haha <laughs> yeah remember that he has a yeah comment on this no bareback in the great outdoors? <laughs> there are some nasty in this cabin. A movable feast. It's a knife. Let's keep moving. I think there's one right here. Wasn't there? Oh yeah, you can see it actually. It's a dead deer. Ties in with something with just a second. Like, I may have missed the piece of it. Ooh, Mr. Simple. Mason. Officer Bennett? What's going on? I'm looking for you. Where the hell did you run off to? I'm in some woods. You just ran from a police officer. What? Come on. Look, Mr. Mason. I need to find my daughter. Christ. I'm not under arrest, am I? Mr. Mason. Get yourself back here now. Do not make things difficult for yourself. I'm heading back to town. There we go, we got our number now. Yeah, this one's a little heavy. It's a deer skull. Come on, Joel. You think that it was you shot and dying, not the deer. Get your hands out of your pants and be a man. My son, the queer. Shoot the damn thing. Shoot, you queer. Wow. Yep, different variations on the same thing. Some of them are Not Sun Hill. Far as the crow flies. Right, so we go wait east, really? I mean east. Away from here. Well, it is this way, but we can't go this way, so we gotta go around. I think that's the trick, yeah. Here we go, another cabin. Cabin! How am I driving? 555-7243. Five, 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 three. We could drive it. Oh, we could. We could call it.
What is that shadow of a child over there? Hey, kid! What is this? <gasps> oh no, the freeze is taking over. What are we gonna do? It's time. It's time for another nightmare. Shit, you can't go here. Oh wow, why did I think to even go there? Why did I think it would work? The, the, this track's called Devil's Laughter, but it always sounds to me like they're chanting that. Run faster, Harry? Yeah, you can actually hide. Yeah. Nice. I never actually bothered too much with that. Can actually get them off your back oh they're morphing okay so what they look like depends on how you play and these ones with the hole inside they're a little concerning all right there's a there's a torch there i might get to it before it gets to me quick quick, quick. Right. when i see more of them like right now They, they load the light. Left door, let's go to the left door. Should I mind the same place? I hope not. Whoa! Down, boy! Am I not coming back, man? Did I turn around because I tried to fuck? Yep. And I lost the torch. Alright, let's go. Let's take the upper route. Whoa! I messed up a little, but it'll be okay. The game's struggling with itself. Just a little. No, I should have gone up. Oh, I fucked up. That's 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 what I messed up. Can I climb up? Yeah, I can. Wish I had that torch still. All right, might have pulled. Might have pulled through. Follow the light. The light will tell me where to go. It's like in Left 4 Dead 1, you just follow the light and you know where to go. Oh shit, I think I passed it, yeah, alright. Let's go left, 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 left. Oh, I'm limping, that's not good. Not good, not good, not good, why is there so many of them? I angered them and I'm back where I started. No, I'm not. Oh. Go, 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 you can do it, boy, you can do it. Yep, I, I did turn around, let's look at the map. Yeah, I did turn around. I gotta go get to that blue cabin over there. So instead of going in circle, it's just behind me now. Damn, they're angry. Oh. All right, this time follow the light.
Do not stray from the light. There it is. That's where I messed up. Should have kept going, kept going this way. The blur is getting to me. Oh, my eyes are sweating. Have I really lost them? All right, that's what I need. It's mom and dad fighting and a kid on the bed. Family I'm vacation. On the phone. Yeah, I'm coming back early. This was a stupid idea. Mom! Not now, honey. Mommy's on the phone. Get out of bed. Play with your daughter. Mommy! Shush! Go show daddy. This whole trip was a bad idea. A week picnicking and cycling like that's gonna make it right. I'm still hurting. It feels fake. I don't want to be with him. I won! Mom! I won! All right. In a minute. Give me a second, Diane. Kamala. Ni na srce moje. Je vam lepo tamo vama dvema djevojka. Oh, we're still running. Alright, so now we gotta get all the way east. Yeah, I gotta go through all these cabins if I remember, yeah. Let's keep going. Yeah, the frame rate is surprisingly better. Surprisingly, amazingly better with the light off. As soon as you turn the light on, which I get, they really, it's, it's, it's a wonder this game even ru runs on the PS2, really. Oh, there's a torch, nice. That's what I need. Fuck you right away. Look at how many of them there are. Where the fuck are you going? Oh my! Oh my! I think I should have gone left, huh? Yeah, left. Because we're going kind of counterclock. Oh, gee! Straight on him. Yeah, okay, I'm going the right way. Bravo! Just don't stop. Don't stop! Oh, shit, did I fuck up again? Should I have gone up? Yeah, I need to go up faster. That's okay, I can do it. Yeah, there's a stair, there are stairs that I didn't see. Almost there. There we go. Suddenly it's daylight, like nothing ever happened. It's really good effects. Brand Overlook. Yes, kid. A memento. 
Spend beauty. And we got a we got one of these. Oh, what was it? Deep pad right. Yeah. It's a crying girl. No. Please. Come on. You've been giving me that look all night. Oh, this dress. That dress has got me all hot and bothered. No. Damn. There's a lot of story in the background which I'm skipping. Like, as I said, this is a quick game. Well, would you look at that? It's Midwich High School. The original was elementary school, which is the version that was adapted into DVD as well. But in this, in the Shattered Memories, it's actually a high school. Simple. Officer? Harry, I've been calling you. Did you switch your phone off? No, I just, uh, I was, I don't know where I was. Harry, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm out of the woods. I'm on a football field. I think it's the high school. Midwich High School. Listen, Harry, Midwich has a gym. They often use it as an emergency shelter in severe weather. Go to the gym and wait there for me. Emergency shelter? Cheryl could have been taken there. Yes, Cheryl could be there. Will you do this for me? Yeah, I I'm going. Man, she's so nice here. Cheryl's not there, I can't wait. I'm sorry, I just can't. Harry, it Fair enough. I am looking for my daughter, so after we all. we get to the halcyon days of high school. When I was starting out, the popular theory said it was their mom and dad that screwed a person up. But if you really want to screw someone up, I say, send them to high school. You probably spent more time talking than studying at school. Lots of study groups, right? Man, I love how this changes. Let's move on. I'm going to throw out some words. Kitty. Not when they fit how you were at school. Shake your head if they don't. All right, let's do. Let's make a personality. Jock. No. Next. Slut. No. I should have said jock, but not slut. Drunk. No. <laughs> ah. Virgin. Got me, dear. <laughs> Bully. Nah. <clears throat> and slacker. Nah, just a virgin. <laughs> I want to see what this is gonna be like. Okay. <coughs> Let's take a different tack. On the what? table, I've laid out a blank timetable and some cards with lessons what? on them. Pick out the lessons to show me your perfect school day. Don't leave any empty. There are only four periods, and I've allocated a very generous lunch. A very generous lunch. Let's see. Something I never picked. Theater. Or re religion. Let's throw religion into mix. With sex ed. Ooh. Spicy. And uh, geography. Let's see what we get. If that was all there was to it, it would have been a breeze, wouldn't it? Come on, let's talk more about the bad stuff that happened at school. More stuff to read? I'm just gonna go straight behind and I know this school like it's my own. Better than my own. <laughs> Zazitivi director, pa kad ne bude plate, onda ćemo vidjeti šta će biti. <laughs> Let's 
Right, so... <clears throat> we're not closer to finding Cheryl. Nothing there but a dead rat. Tammy will... I guess suck your dick for tequila? Choking game. All students, there is a craze at the moment for young adults to try what is often called the choking game. Don't be stupid. Don't risk your young lives or your health. The kids who have died playing this game died senseless tragic deaths. Heed their warning and don't join them. I don't know if you know what to do now. We had a lot of fun and we were looking for a girl in the game. But all these strange things are happening. Let's go this way. Often you have two routes you can take. As I said at the beginning and it uh, changes some things because it notes the decision you took which route attracted your attention athletic club it's not here what the fuck oh i must have cat house so it's a whorehouse and over here is a pharmacy what about the pharmacy how about that pharmacy can you go there without? Can you do one with the uh, without the other? Remember, they are connected with that above. But yeah, it's snowed in. You know what? I'm gonna just go through the whorehouse. Interesting uh, bit there. It is a whorehouse after all. Well. Where did I enter? There? So I can go. Is that right? No. There. I entered there so I can go here. There's something there. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was I was so angry. I, I just I wanted it to be so perfect, you know. I guess seeing the, the wig kind of killed the moment. You you, all, you almost had it. So he hit her. And all these stories can, like these are stories of the citizens of Silent Hill, right? But. Uh, they can be your stories depending on how you play they're all possibilities basically the man you could have been if you did things different or the man you actually were it's all on you suffocated forever and there's a there's an insect inside amber hmm symbolic Jump over! Whee! Ooh, more about the choking game, that's right. Man, that was awful. Why didn't anyone tell Rick? Why didn't anyone tell me Rick was Todd's best friend? Man, that joke is all over the school anyway. Yeah, I didn't get this one. I guess his friend died and they made fun of it. Because kids? My plastic perfect girl. It's a naked doll. There we go. That's where I need to be. Midwich High School. Five 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 one two two. Let's try calling them. You know, before we barge in, straight to the phone. What did they say? Five 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 one two two. You've 
Beach Midwich High School. Here at Midwich, every student feels special. Our students' emotional well-being is as important as their academic achievement. Midwich High School is currently closed. Well, fuck you. I like how you can hang up. Another message. The, the car moved on its own. Pigtails, second Look part. Look at you. Aren't now you why was he mad? the most perfect school girl there ever was? With those pigtails, I doubt there is any little girl in the world quite as perfect as you. That's why he got angry. You know, it's bizarre in this little story. Always stri struck me real hard. He was mad at the whore because she looked like his kid and... Uh, that angered him, that's why he hit her. But the whorehouse is right across from the street from the school. Now I know this is for the... We'll find, we'll see at the end why things are the way they are. <laughs> it's not every, not everything is as it seems, so... It's for the purpose of the story, but it's still bizarre if you think about it. Dropping your kid off at school and then just like, Yeah, I'm gonna just drop by across the... Across the road for a... For some daddy fun. Just... A big no-no. Heavenly protection. Oh, it's Saint Christopher. Yep, that's <laughs> that's again Silent Hill lore. This game is the best if you played the others in the series, but you, it's also very good to enjoy on its own. There's a hung kid on the wall. No, don't, don't, don't save it. No, I didn't want to save it. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. I'm Serbian. I'm, I'm a mix, <laughs> Serbian, Hungarian. There's a little bit of Bosnian as well. Oh, yeah. oh, oh it's oh. different. Huh. Oh, wow. Usually I get the other one where he says, that's a, what a nice belt, mom. <laughs> Maybe some lost cousin, who knows? Welcome to the stream, uh, to the stream, Dart342. Hope you're enjoying the program. Where is she? There she is. After her. Wait, there's more. I know it's cold to do it this way, but you don't listen when I talk. Sorry, it's over. I can't do this if you won't open up to me, Steve. Oh, nice, Real new, whole new setup. But yeah, close by, very close by. We're neighbors, basically. John Winham, school founder. Well, hello, Mr. Winham. Windham. <laughs> Let's just get on with it. Again, two routes. Prom. Caitlin, if you haven't already got someone, I was thinking that maybe you'd like to be my prom date. Mike. Showing us a map. I'm looking for the gym. Well, a gym you'll get. Which classroom? Whichever I get into. Oh, alright. I've seen this before. Teach him arrive uh, if the he come back we can we cut him again what lesson canceled today due to illness die mr gordon's oh it's a, again a reference to silent hill one but also something personal i'd say wait can you change this no i thought there's a puzzle in this there should be a puzzle somewhere in this yeah but well it is it is ps2 yeah it is it is ps2 but uh it's originally a wii game it's ported to uh, to the PS2, but you know it's one of those late PS2 games, so I keep saying the frame rate is pretty good. So it's full 50 fields because it's a PAL version, full 50 fields without the torch. But as soon as you enable the torch, it drops to like noticeably. Even in the stream, you can see it. There we go. We got something here. Oh, we've been here. Wait, really? 
So I've just made a circle. <laughs> Alright, that's not where I wanted to go. We we're supposed to follow the kid, but I did follow her over there. Aha, uh -huh, okay. Just go to another cast castle, <laughs> to another classroom. Room 4D, alright. Mr. Gordon, 555-5464. Let's try it. Is this another prank call? You speak up. You think this is scaring me? I don't deserve this. Poor man. Really rich backstory in the game. For each of the important or not important char characters, they you can actually find out a lot about their lives. So let's go to this classroom. It's going to be one of them, I'm sure. Waitress wanted. Need work. We're not going to call that. Oh, which one is this? How nice it is when you can press a button to turn the flashlight on. Right? That sounds means we're looking for a little girl. Where is she? Where did she go? Fuck, I'll go this way. I didn't see where she went. I'm gonna assume she went this way. Plantarium or art studio? Let's go to art studio this time. I think last time we went to plantarium. Damn, that's weird. Oh, it's these things. Okay, look at that. So you gotta, you gotta, you probably gotta assemble them in a certain way. All right. I, I don't know this one, or at least I don't remember it. I usually go to the planetarium. So ball, holding down, holding up, and two swans kissing. All right. So let's make the swans kiss. Hi kitty. They gotta hold the balls, huh? One down and one next to it up. So what do we get? We should get numbers if I do it right. Four. Let's see again. What? Love? Can you let the kitty out? Thank you. Two swans next to... No, are they swans? Yeah, swans next to each other and these two with balls next to each other. So I guess that this guy is... No, we can't even move that guy. Okay, I see how that's gonna make a number. I see, I see. So we get... Hello, senpai! This one's actually good. This is the best puzzle I've seen in the entire game. So it's, I'm gonna say it's 8467, whatever it is, some kind of password. Nice. Hmm, <laughs> looks familiar. How you doing, senpai? Look, this is all senpai art. What did I say the password was? 8, 8, 4, yeah, no. Is it 8? 8, 4, then what are the swans? 678467. That's that's really good. That's I like this one. 8467, 8467. Unlock somewhere else. But where? You still playing RE4 remake? You liking it? You replaying it? Where does it unlock? Where where did I miss the thing? I've never done this one, I think. It's so unfamiliar. But where do you where do you punch the numbers? Here? No. Fourth playthrough. Wow. Gee. Okay. You like it. It's official. No more heroes. What was that? But where do you where do you put the code in? What am I missing? Let's snoop around. I don't see anything.
Huh. All right. But where? Oh, I remember, I remember, I remember. I think I heard from uh, Matt McMuscles. Yeah, all right. So that must be very fun. That looks like James Sunderland. Creepily, but it does. All right, man. What the fuck am I missing? So I came in through there. There's nothing there. Nothing there. There's just a photo. I used the photo to make... Up, down. Come on. Yeah, it's not like... It's not like I need to do anything else, you know, and... Uh, I, I see the number and I just need to punch it in. Oh, 84555. Where else would it be? Did I do that right? It has to be an 8. 4. 6, 7. I'm not crazy, am I? 5, 5, 5. 8. 4. Is it 6? Am I doing it right? Let's try again. Is anybody else seeing something different here? Am I missing something? It's gotta be an 8. It's got can't be anything else, right? What's the most interesting puzzle? And RE7 stole it. Can't move that guy, so yeah. I wouldn't call that anything other than 8. Six. Is it seven? What else could it be if not seven? Maybe even while, while I'm looking at it. Oh, you can turn them. Yeah, but we, we wouldn't want to. That's eight, definitely. That's four. That's six. And it has to be seven. It can't be... Oh the hell you can move it maybe one eight four six one what about this guy you can't move him let's try one Right, senpai, remember this? Because I'm stuck. Can't believe I'm stuck in shattered memories, but here we are. Nothing I can't literally can't do anything with this. What else could it be? Maybe something down here. There we go. Oh my god, look at that. 8465. That's wonderful. Shadows, there we go. <laughs> that that was cool. Doors open. Thank you. Thank you so much. That was actually wow, bravo game. Here's a good one. I, I I laughed at the puzzles after that being brought to my attention, but man, this one was really good. Come back here. Dahlia, check out the new outfit hot xxx dahlia oh she's gonna be a we're going to punk her route are we use electronic devices no mine switched off 1053 uh really oh that's the lockers i think 1053 all right 1053 1053 10.53 Wherefore 
are the there we go 1031 all right Ten thirty one. There we go, made it. Here's to us. We're never gonna get old. Never gonna be like our parents. Never gonna blend in. Oh wow, okay, never gonna blend in. That part's different. I guess they're not gonna blend in. Comment on it? Not gonna comment on it? The only color photo. Oh, okay. Alright, you can be stubborn if you want to. Oh, wow. She's dressed different. Very timid. Did the music change? Like the instruments? Or maybe I'm listening to the soundtrack too much. Sorry if I interrupted you. Oh, I didn't realize there was anyone else in here. I'm looking for an emergency shelter. I guess... You're not here for the reunion? No. Just my luck. Did everyone else get the message except for me? What a screw up. Lacking in finesse, but ten for effort. Oh, he didn't catch her. Michelle Valdez. Harry Mason. Nice to meet you, Harry. So, what brings you here? I'm looking for my daughter. She's missing. I convinced myself she'd be here. She's a Midwich student? No, no. She's just seven. Her name is Cheryl. Cheryl Mason? Yeah. There was a Cheryl Mason when I was here. She was above me at school. Ah. Must be a different girl, same name. She's seven. How I'll many Cheryl Masons are there? There you go. That's an old photo. You say she ran off? No, we were in a car accident. That can't be my daughter. How many Cheryl Masons could there be in a small town like this? She there you looks go. like you. There is a resemblance, but... My Cheryl's just a kid. You don't sound so sure. Come on. The principal's office? Yeah. If we're lucky, the door won't be locked. 
Bingo. <laughs> We're breaking into the principal's office? Well, the door was unlocked. And we both feel bad about it. <laughs> Sorry, Mrs. Albright. She's still around. I remember her. <laughs> she was when I graduated. She's part of the furniture, right? Varnish, too. That's the principal's PC with all the school records on it. A gang of kids in my class used to hack it to change their grades. And you? Hey, I didn't need to cheat. They never got caught, but it rattled Principal Fisher. He used to change his passwords every day. I don't think it helped. Are we gonna hack his PC? Yeah. See if you can pull up the records for Cheryl Mason. See if my Cheryl and your Cheryl are the same. And if they're not, we can get out of here? Sure. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just gonna text my boyfriend. He was supposed to meet me here. All right, let's look for clues. Gotta hack the computer. Forgotten your password? Click here. All right. I am clicking. There you go. Please answer this security question. The king of sports, a man's game of a man's game of squash. What could that be? Let's look around. Geology. We're in Hawaii. Man, no one said hacking would be, be this hard. Jesus fucking Christ, Mark. <laughs> I'm trying to hack a computer here, man. Don't scare me like that. No pistols in this Silent Hill. <laughs> Man's Wrecked Ball. There we go. Wrecked Ball. Second place state champion. It says 1988. How are you doing, buddy? Did you get some rest? 1988. Yeah, I guess that's the thing. I'm not gonna type racquetball. Look, a video game with a QWERTY realistic keyboard. Who would have thought? Oh, incorrect. Racquetball, maybe? Racquetball. Okay, racquetball. Racquetball. Ball. Ball. Probably the best Shakespeare comedy. Alright. Da. Oh, comrades. You want some da. Well, I'll give you da to talk about. Senpai, this morning I had a stream with... <laughs> no, that's still Russian, damn it. I had a stream with uh, chaos and mutation. And it was, it was wonderful. Hamlet, Henry V. What are the other ones? Can't see game, you gotta help me so I can see shit. I'm gonna say Hamlet. Is that a comedy? Kinda like everything by Shakespeare sounds like comedy. What is what what is a comedy here? Henry Fifth maybe? Hamlet. Hamlet. I will type in Hamlet and see what happens. More Shakespeare. More Shakespeare in in Silent Hill games. No, Henry, Hen, Hen, the red Henry. <laughs> it was Henry V. No, which could it be? <laughs> oh, you will, you will. Come help me, Englishman. I'm sorry, man from Britain, help me. <laughs> will. Well, I don't know that book. What is that? Twelfth Night? Twelfth Night? Is that a comedy? Like, it's very hard for me to discern what when Shakespeare was serious. Twelfth, I don't know what Twelfth Night is. Twelve... Boy, how do you spell that? Twelve... Vut... Oops. Damn it. T. Shit. 
I never got stuck on this. I'm trying to hack this account. I need the best Shakespeare comedy from here. Maybe it is on the... Maybe it is on the wall, on a poster. On a poster. Give me more Shakespeare comedy. Twelfth... Twelfth... Okay, maybe the... Maybe I... Is Twelfth Night the comedy? Is it... Is it Shakespeare at all? <laughs> yeah, I mean... What? Probably the best Shakespeare comedy. I'm trying to hack a principal's account to find my daughter. Who seems to be 20 years older than I remember. So... We were in a car crash. Twelfth... Uh, there we go my bitch of an ex-wife's name all right we gotta find her oh, i remember where you find the clue for her that one's pretty common actually because he was unhappy with his marriage um here herman 65 okay that's herman but what about his ex-wife herman <laughs> Uh, consider a physical comedy. I didn't know. I don't know about that one. I don't even know if I heard about it. That's weird. We gotta find some uh, something about his wife. For dad from auto. So it's not that thing. Maybe it's on the mug. Auto again. That's that's the son. But where's the wife? Married in Hawaii. That's the that's the dog. What about the wife? Oh, it'll be a note from the second. Uh, try Karen, huh? You know it will be funny if it turns out to be Karen. It's gonna be a note on a, on the secretary's computer. There we go. Herman's ex called angry. Call her back. Five 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 nine four three three. All right. Let's do that. Thank you. Thank you, Valerie. You've been very helpful. I think that's the last one. Shit's about to hit the fan again. That'll be the third nightmare. Valerie. Password reset to Sunday 45. That part never changes, though. Sunday 45. No, don't pause. I was gonna skip it. There we go. Shit. You break it? It just froze on me. Froze, you say? It is her. It is her. We moved? You don't remember because of the accident? Simmons Street. It's not a great neighborhood. Why would we move there? Guess the cop was right. My ID was old. That wasn't my house. He went there and was like, my house. Forget. There's a phone number. Why don't you call it? I will. There's no reception. I'll be outside. Good luck. Yes? Cheryl? No, Dahlia. Do you want me to find her? Who's calling? It's her father, Harry Mason. Is she okay? Harry? Is she okay? Who the hell do you think you are? Sorry? What's the... Leave me alone! Fucked up, boy. Going nuts, boy. I'm looking for my daughter. We were in a car accident, Mark, and uh, I was looking for her in a sky high school, and I found a photo of her with this lady. She was much older than she was supposed to be, so now it's all shitty and I'm in a nightmare. Let me quickly take a look at the map. So we need to get to the entrance, which is right there, but it's not as simple. So we're gonna have to go through everything, I'm sure, and try not to fuck up. Run faster, man, you're getting chased in a nightmare.
You know, DVD. Yeah, this is Silent Hill. The, the one I was telling you about. Did you see my message? You didn't see it? <laughs> I thought that's why you came over here. It's the one I've been telling you about a lot. I was hoping Joe could not, wouldn't work today and he'd be able to see it. He was like, I'm already here. <laughs> Silent Hill. Silent Hill. Oh, bye. <laughs> I like... Oh, we just missed each other, I guess. Right, I'm next to the car. <laughs> Is it here? This one's gonna be a little tougher because we're gonna have to solve a puzzle while running away. This is my second favorite Silent Hill. It's actually right there with Silent Hill 2. The, the universally the best Silent Hill game. Entrance, that's what we need. Entrance, yeah. There they are, they're looking for me. I turned off my flashlight because it's harder for them to find me. Alright? Loud mountain, huh? <laughs> yeah, it does. Alright? Voicemail. The door's locked. Shit, I'm stuck out here. I'll try and get the doors open. You go take the photos. Don't lose your nerve. I told you she's with him. Get some photos and we'll catch the asshole red-handed. And you get a kiss for every photo. It changes. So I've played this game many times, guys. Well, you you two are here now. i played it so many times. And some of the things I haven't seen because I haven't played like this. The game reads your... Like, it studies how you play. And it even the monsters change their look based on your choices. And a lot of these conversations change, but some of them are completely new to me. So we got a hot paparazzi spots. The courtyard, the parking lot, and the locker rooms. Get some sizzlers. We gotta get some photos while running. Heal us, Mark! Mark, heal! Help, Mark! <laughs> what was it, left? Yeah. Courtyard, parking, and lockers, right? Is that what it said, right? Courtyard, parking, lot, and locker rooms. Okay, so I think I know how this is going to go. No, not that. Map. Yeah, okay. Courtyard has to be there. The parking where we saw the car and locker room is down there where the gym is. So, yeah, I should be able to do. Thank you, love. Should be good with this. Okay, back in action. There's one. And we get a torch. Nice. Nice. Photo number one. Come on, quickly, quickly. No time to fuck around. All right. Run, run, fool. You know, I told you first time I played DVD, it kind of, I kind of thought they took some of the, some things from this game. <laughs> I like it. I like being told what to do. I'm used to that. I'm from Serbia. <laughs> Are we in the gym? Yeah, locker rooms should be around here somewhere. Right? Or did I get that wrong? That's what I thought, like locker rooms, you know, right next to the gym. Man, they really do take longer to find you without the lights. Shit, that's not a locker room. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it does mark it. I, I, I'm right next to it. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> no, camera, 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 camera. Good counts, counts. Run! Run, motherfucker, run! Wow, okay. So not just like that it improves the frame rate, but it improves your odds of running away from them. Gotta keep the flare. Pull down. And run. The Yeah, the third one's here. All right. <laughs> oh, not close enough. There we go. Let's go back. If they're around, I'm just gonna burn this. Was it up? Oh, let's go up. 
Hi, kitty. Welcome, kitty. All right, I, I think I think I escaped them. Really. Fuck the flare. All right, just to the left of me. Let's go up. I could hide in a locker under a bed, but Jason's gonna kill me. <laughs> Should we do? Oh, did I did I go the wrong way? Actually, no. That's good. Oh yeah, I remember this place. Look, there are monitors stuck in the ice up there. It will make sense later, I swear. <laughs> They're not here. Okay, I'm close. Safe. They all broke. Three new messages. Who's that in teacher's car? Yes, it is. She can't wait till they get get to the motel. Oh, a different, different, different description. But I, I know the photo. And her look also depends on you know what we do, like everyone else. Check this out. Now, not as innocent as the as she acts. Hot and soapy for the camera. Oh, she's taking a shower. I don't see what's wrong with that. Now we know how she got her A. Staying late, late after class. All right. I wonder how many variations. I read on some fan sites, they still didn't know a couple of years ago how many variations there are to the story, depending on how you play. Harry? I was about to head off. I thought I ought to wait a little longer. Thanks. You okay? Any luck with the phone? They didn't make any sense. Tonight? I need to go there. The Simmons Street address? That's the other side of town. You got a car? I was planning on getting a ride with John. There's my boss's SUV. Yeah, I'm Immediately. Out there while she's Immediately. On it's at the club where I work. Not far from here. I could give you a lift. Oh, that would be great. Lead the way. <laughs> I should give Are you my you? jacket. I'm okay. You keep it. It's cold. You had a car accident. I can't take your coat. Well, if you want it, just ask. <laughs> I'll holler. It also takes note, like, if you look at their, at the girl's breasts or buttocks, <laughs> posteriors, it will take note and skew the nightmare towards that. If I'd seen the forecast, I wouldn't be here. I'd be watching TV from under my comforter. Mmm, with a big bowl of champarado. <laughs> a plate of churros. You know churros? I make the best you'll ever taste. I'll take your word for it. Well, it's dark here. We need the flashlight. All right, Senpai's coming to pick you up. <laughs> she didn't say which, John. <laughs> so the, the like I said, the characters and locations, save for Michelle, are all from the from Silent Hill One, but you know because it's the it's a reimagining, not a remake. They really had creative freedom with it. We're almost there. I was beginning to think we were lost. Thanks for the vote of confidence. How come you don't know the way? I don't think I've ever been to this place. Well, that figures. How so? I don't know. You're older than you look, right? How old do I look? Too young to have a daughter at Midwich. But you dress like my dad. Oh, kick a man when he's down, why don't you? <laughs> hey, I like men who look like my dad. Your Ooh. John, was it? Hey, he looks okay. Like dad? No, but John is a jerk. Did you hear that? Well, not just that. You don't want to know. Trust me. Yeah, this is a new okay. one. Sun Hill Vet Veterans Trust. Caring of the elderly. Sorry, I was reading signs. So, yeah, I've never heard this one. I'm repeating myself, but man, am I glad, w glad when I, for streams, I want to mix it up and I get a whole new game. It's not the first game I had this with. I was like, I've never seen this. Because <laughs> I always play in the same exactly fucking way. <laughs> 
there's the Balkan club. It, it, in the original game, in the first game, it was a church where you meet Dahlia Gillespie. But <laughs> hey, that's what she said. <laughs> Literally. Can I see some ID? Over 21s only. Sorry, mine was taken by a cop. <laughs> really? How come? I'm not sure she trusts me. Well, I'll let you in just this once, but first sign of trouble. Such a mix. Also, I've never seen this dress on... Again, Cynthia, is it her name? Yeah. I've never seen this dress on her. Usually she's in the pink Balkan. and red. The Balkan. It's my oh, home. The Balkan saying? Peninsula. You okay? Yeah. Still pissed at John. He was supposed to be here last night, but had some story last about night, the weather. Last night, John. Give him a call. You mind running upstairs to my room? That's where I left the keys. John? Where have you been? I... Well, okay, I, I guess that makes sense, but you should have called. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Yeah, I guess I'm being a little emotional. <laughs> Is that what he said to her? Calm down, woman. <laughs> oh, a message from Dahlia. Horny, where are you? Yeah, John, I don't know if you saw, but we got the punker Dahlia. Which means she's gonna be wild. I don't know what I did to trigger that that one, but... Where could the key be? Let's try... Um, behind the curtain. Aha! Uh -huh. You key. Uh, it's not messy. Oh, Could it be... It's a friend. Here. Could it be... In the cookie jar? Twisty, twisty. Ah, uh, but nice cookies. I would love... I love cookies like that, man. No, it's, it's not... It's not. Almost, but not. Oh, there's gonna be some nudes later. Oh, there we go. Found it. I found it. Take it out. It's right there. We could have also rifled through her underwear. And I think from all the choices you have in the game, I've never figured out what it is, what choice. So whichever room I picked first, the purple or the red, it would have been her room. But I've never found... You know, the other one is automatically locked as soon as you pick one. But I've never found out what difference does that make. <laughs> you want you want to do that? Sure. I was going for just... N I'm going for a no, no... Not going for a specific ending. So let's... Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it right now. Mark wants to see some... Yeah, he hasn't seen any uh, female underwear ever. So this is what it looks like, Mark. There you go. The key isn't here, though. It would have been. It's always the third spot, but... <laughs> Mostly. <laughs> there you go. No, but yeah, please calm down. Don't 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 foam at the mouth now. All right. Only the stuff I own. <laughs> I got the keys. A drink before we head off. Sure. What are we celebrating? Ah. Uh... Let's see. Another chance you can look at her boobs, but don't be a pig. What you got in the, in the hand there? Don't worry, Harry. We'll be at Simmons Street soon. You'll see your daughter and your wife. Everything will... Wife? Sure, you're married, right? I saw your ring. Harry? He doesn't remember a thing. Suddenly I feel sick. Suddenly I feel sick. I apparently I'm married. <laughs> That's the proper reaction, I guess. <laughs> well, yeah, you should. Trebalo da gledaš na kompu, mama. Joj, ja sam mislio da ti gledaš na kompu. All this time as this is happening, I'm talking to a psychiatrist and, you know, if you missed that part, Mark. Who's Michelle? There we go. We got that. Wow. All right. Go now. Ultra punk Dahlia. Uh oh. Where's Michelle? Funny, 
Come on, let's get going. It's really a trippy game. You, Mr. Harry, are way over the limit. Stop. This is out of control. I came in here with a girl called Michelle. She was going to drive me to Simmons Street. Who are you? Are you on something? I'm Dahlia. Hottest piece of ass you'll ever see in this town. You are Harry Mason. Generally, a fun guy to be with. What are you wearing these for? Bravo, Mama, bravo. Stop being a dick and let's get going. We'll get to Simmons Street and see Cheryl. Cheryl? Cheryl? Your daughter. Oh, the one we're looking on, for? Not that wasted. That's why we're in this lousy club. To get the SUV so we can drive up to Simmons Street. That's right, but... I like how the... No more craziness. The, it matches what he heard, but the details are different. Just like, like what the game does to the player. Hexen, Nordlander. I, had, I like that SUV. I have the same brand. <laughs> What you said, we haven't had a nightmare in a while. Well, are you in luck? Are we the only people on the road? Apparently, yeah. I guess that means we don't have to stop for any red lights. One way. Screw that. Let's cut up on Kincaid. Ooh. You're very quiet. Oh, you, did Mark? Henry. You're not going to be sick, are you? Did Mark teach you how to drive on the left side of the street? What? How long have you known me? I don't know. She's driving on the left. I don't know you. I can't remember you since the car I know British people made this, sense. but... Don't do this to me, Harry. Don't start tripping out on me. When you said you crashed your car, you didn't mention this. Tam, are you in pain? No pain. And I can remember most things. Just sometimes. Some details I, I try to focus, but then they slip away. And I think I'm seeing things. You really don't know who I am. No. Sid and Nancy? Oh, who are Sid and Nancy? My tits? You named them? We're sleeping together? This is a joke, right? A really lame joke. I wish it was. I'll boop your nose. Boop. <laughs> shit. The bridge is up. No shit! What can we do? Run up to the control room. See if you can get it moving. <sighs> okay. Oh, I lost my glasses. That's right. You just accept it. I'm with another girl now. I guess I'll just do this. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I wonder if that's an oversight. Because the Cl Climax Studio is a UK studio, right? So the locations, like I said, are like in Silent Hill 1. There is this location with very similar goal to do. Jefferson Bridge Control Tower. But uh, yeah, still different. I don't know what to do about this. I'm not I'm not qualified for this. Let's see if there's anything in maintenance. Oh, there's a Ford num phone number. 555-3411. Let's try that. Jimmy Coppola. <laughs> Hopes and dreams. <laughs> oh my god, John. That is so dark. Oh, it's different. So, like, everything's different tonight. Yeah, Harry. Harry Mason. All right, Harry. Uh, I'll tell you how to operate the controls. First, you need to... Right. Mr. Capra. Are you getting this? Then you... Yeah, okay, I'll... And then I'll do... Oh, Harry. I'm getting bored. I'm coming. <laughs> I'm coming. I'm coming. <laughs> I'm coming behind him. All right, now we wait a bit. I remember this part. There we go. New voicemail from Jimmy Co Coppola. Yeah, Mr. Mason. I guess we got cut off. I can't seem to get through on your phone. Listen, to lower the bridge, here's what you do. Uh, first, you push the start button. A colored light will come on. If it's blue, move the center lever. 
Now, if it's red, move the left lever. If it's green, don't do anything. Just wait. And if the yellow light comes on, move the right lever. So red, blue, yellow. You just gotta keep doing this until the bridge engages. Okay? What a so what a weird system. So red, blue, yellow. All right. Red. Yellow. Blue. Green. There goes the bridge. We 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 did it. We did it. Whippy! We got the bridge. All right, Dahlia, I'm a coming. Coming behind you. Fuck the light, it's slowing my game down. Bridge is ready. All right, let's go. I'm sure it's gonna be safe. We're gonna find out ev everything we want to know. And why is this not freaking you out? Me not knowing you. This isn't the first time you've acted weird, Harry. What does that mean? Be straight with me. Stop it. If you know my daughter, I know of her. Let's not go there. So what are you to me? Why do you have to be like this? Just leave things be, Harry. Oh Harry, shit! Dahlia! You you prodded <laughs> you prodded too deep. Shouldn't have asked the questions. Better be in the fog forever. It's the only uh, FMV cutscene in the game I know of. Maybe the one at the beginning, but yeah. Hasasha saw that. She's she's perplexed. Oppenheim Kant. Kant Chant. What does that mean, Mark? What is that from? All right, a little trippy part. If you got a phobia from these things. <laughs> All right, we gotta we gotta get out of here before we drown. So let's start touching things. I'm sure something will help. Well, I gotta try to get out of the car. Maybe from the behind. Unlock. Not helping. She's frozen here. We've sank all the way to the bottom, okay? I'm sure it'll be okay. I've been un and frozen underwater. Fuck it and Nancy. Look, the bridge is like fucked up. If you look around and not panic because you're about to drown, it actually looks pretty nice. Oh, I wanted to turn the radio on. Fuck, I didn't do it. Let's try another another door. Door? What door? Ah, all right, we fell to the bottom. All right. I guess I'll just die. Would be nice if I had a flashlight. Dropped it. Oh, there we go. Well, it wasn't that lucky. Jesus. Stop fighting. All right, I guess I'll follow their instructions. I don't have, <laughs> I don't have anything better. Yeah, Sash. I'm a little drowning. Oh, it sounds like. We'll be there soon. Wow. So cold. The song that she just sang. Okay, now I can escape.
Oh shit, I'm locked in. This door is open, I'm sure, because I opened it earlier. Ugh. All right. I'm sure this will be fine. What's the worst that can happen in frozen water? She'll be fine. <laughs> Dory? Oh, because of Nemo? That's the only Dory that pops into my mind. Oh, Oppenheim and Chant. Okay. <laughs> Doesn't. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. It, they all float, Mark. Oh, God. Now that's a proper reaction. I'm a fish, look at my bones! He does look so tired and I like how you can see that. You can see in his face he's getting tired over the course of the game. Alright, we're, we're, we're Nasty, almost inevitable. at the end, almost. Everyone is going to die, even if we like to pretend otherwise. That's true. You could die tonight, in your sleep. Why doesn't that terrify you? If you talk about it, it will. Like to die? No, wait. Let me guess. You want to die in your sleep. It's academic, really, as we're only truly conscious of death when it happens to others. If you get to my age, you'll have seen plenty of people die. There, one minute. This is this hits more now than 12 years ago. Okay, game time. There are seven pictures of people on the table. Your job is to tell me who is dead. And I smell. Really sleeping. Divide them up. She's right. cooking something great. Right, sleeping. What do you think, guys? What would you say? I know the answer. There is no right answer. I can do it. Well, it doesn't really matter. We're going for no specific ending. Dead. Yeah, you say Mark. Dead. All right, dead. Mark says everyone's dead. Let's see. Mark knows these, these things. And dead. All dead. Sleep. Dead, dead, sleep. This was the third one, alright? There you go, Mark. Fourth. I'm gonna assume... Oh, okay, there you go. I would have assumed wrong. Oops. That could be dead drunk. What, did you say sleep again? Dead, dead. Dead. Dead drunk. <laughs> and finally, she's wasted as hell. Look at that. There's... Also no, there's seven of them. Uneven number. <laughs> Dead. There you go. Mark says this. Done. It's just an exercise. There's no right answer. Actually, they were all dead. Okay. Let's okay, that's you. That he never said that. He never said that. So, like, if you pick them all sleeping, he'll say, "Hi, ah, nice. You figured through my little trick." Also, I got I got SWAT Sybil. Dead tired. I got SWAT Sybil. She was very rude to me at the beginning, Senpai, but then she wasn't. Then she was like, oh, I'm sorry about the earlier. And she was so bitchy at the start. I don't know if it's... What, what did I do at the start to make her like that? Dahlia. Who's Dahlia? Dahlia? A girl. The car went into the river. She drowned. Another crash? This is a different girl? You must have seen the bridge. We went right off the side. Harry, the bridge has been closed since the storm started. You swam. You could have died of hypothermia. My clothes? You were soaked to the skin. I grabbed what I could find here. <laughs> I'm asleep. Look at my yawns. When oh no, it's creeping up. It's a very important info she was going to tell him. 
I gotta wheel myself out of here. Can't even run properly. Al Camilla Hospital from Sun Hill One in Homecoming. The nightmares they're called. Those are the monsters I said. This is the first Silent Hill where I waited the, a weapon all the way to the end. And I was like, I, I'm waiting for the pistol. I got to the end of the game. I was like, oh, there's no weapons here. So you can't fight them. You can only run. And uh, their faces, their looks will warp based on how you play and what you do. Like, remember the psych psychological profiling and all that. So they can look real bizarre. They have several different look mashes they can get and some of them are really disturbing the abstract one is the like the most disturbing in my opinion all right the torch nice yeah it's much better in the dark actually oh i hear it there they are see oh god it's ah i gotta light this right away because it's fucked up they have yeah they're they're getting the abstract way i don't know what i did but they are. Straight or left? Straight or left? Straight or left? Fuck it, go left. But if I leave this here, it will stop them at least. Alright, yeah, that's good. We gotta get to the ER. Punch them in the face. <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see how how deformed they were? If you go, like, if you look at uh, sexy posters, or if you look at women's breasts, as I mentioned, stuff like that, they will go, what I go, horny way. And man, I think that one even that one can be even worse. They'll have they'll have pronounced features. Oh shit! I shouldn't have done that. Like feminine features. And it all ties into the story, right? I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, I want to go back where I came from. Now pull it down, yeah. Then keep running. Bloop. Ignore him. Can't hurt you. If you did that look, look. Oh my god! <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta do this. Yeah, basically what I'm saying. All right, all right, we're safe. That was fast. Oh man, I feel awful. What did we do last night? Where the hell did I leave Christina's SUV? There you go. All right, another family puzzle to solve. So it's a father with a daughter at the doctor. Hospital visit. Yeah, they say she'll be fine. She's young. It'll heal easy. She's fine. She liked the bear and the chocolates. Huh? <laughs> yeah. It's hardly spoiling her. And the song. Then the song, sweetie. I got the DJ to play her song on the radio. Yeah, well, I'll be here for another half hour till visiting time is up. All right, so it's trying to tell me something. They want us to hear a song. Camilla Radio, Healing Through Music, 101.6 FM. I think this, uh, I think this connects to the other story we had just before. Where was it? Frigid, choking game, put pills, family vacation. I'm on yeah, because she got hu cut at the end of this one when they were fighting. What was the frequency? 101.6 5 5 5 8 8 1 and the last digit so 8 8 1 and the last digit we can figure that out easy it's called her favorite song daddy's girl so 4 
five 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 eight eight one and then song is four that is girl here we go we're gonna do it play some corn no that's a different sound hill calling Al Camilla radio your request has been selected for broadcast get well soon She's gonna be okay. Thank God. He's spoiling her rotten, you know. She's gonna get fat, sitting in bed all day eating chocolates. He's trying to make me feel bad. And we're back to normal, just like that. The effects are really nice for a PS2 game. Help! Oh, you can't call for her anymore at this point. Look at that hole in the hospital. Oh, One of my favorite, all-time favorite Sun Hill characters. God, please open. Oh wow, it's not an ambulance. Okay. What the fuck did I do? It's all different. Should have been a crash tabulance. It wasn't even supposed to be here today. <clears throat> it was my day off, but we were three nurses down because of the weather. Damn it. I wasn't supposed to be here. I've never seen her like this. I shouldn't have been here. Hey. Sorry. Cool. I'm just upset. Don't worry, it's nothing. Shouldn't we take you inside? I'm ready to go home. Just ignore the burning car. The is a few blocks north. I can clean myself up there. I'm heading that way. Let me walk you. Lisa? I'm okay, really. But you can keep me company. I'm Harry. Silent Hill has a lot of, as a series, has a lot of references and homages. And her name, Lisa Garland, she's one of the main character, supporting characters from the first game. Her name comes from uh, Judy Garland, Be you know, Wizard of Oz and all that. You know the average ER nurse gets less than five hours sleep a night? I read that in the newsletter. Ronald Reagan ran the country on five hours of sleep a night. I saw that on TV. Yeah, but he got to sit down a lot. The nurse is on her feet all day and night. I don't need a man in my life. I need a really good podiatrist. What is it you do, Harry? Well, not a podiatrist. Figures. I'm a writer. Wow. I didn't know Silent Hill had a famous writer. <laughs> Hardly famous. Have I heard of any of your books? My mom reads a lot. Bet she's read one. Maybe. I wrote a romance series called Longing for the Moon. That was popular with mom. Was that what it's called? Romance? My agent tells me I have great insight into the female imagination. You could put me in one of your books. Life and death drama in the ER. One girl search for love. The nurse falls for the dashing doctor? There are no dashing doctors. They're all alcoholics and perspire too much. I always fall for the guys who look like my dad. And then regret it the next day. Cute. If you were a real writer, you'd be taking notes. Don't you all carry notebooks to write everything down? Not me. I've got a photographic memory. Better. Kitchens. Not far now. You still feeling okay? Yeah. Fine. So tell me about your daughter. Cheryl? You got this She's jacket. Uh... Young, bright, happy. Likes collecting stuff, you know, bits and pieces, bugs. She loves bugs. Bugs? Like dirty, creepy bugs? No, no the butterflies. Bulk. Pretty bugs. She has a collection. Dead ones? Yeah. Still creepy. Not really. You seem to see the creepy in everything. Is that a nurse thing or just you? Definitely a nurse thing. We have a unique outlook on life. Whatever happened to bedside manner? We still got that. For our special cases. Oh, is that where you live? Here we are. 
My apartment is just around the corner. Used to belong to the super. It's a lot bigger than the others, but I only pay standard rent. The landlord has a thing for nurses. That's creepy. Grab a seat. I'm just gonna get out of these things. I oughta. Uh uh, you're not running off yet. Warm up before you head back out there. I haven't thanked you yet. Five minutes. Come on, sit. Sit. Well, that fast. <laughs> hey. The 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 so the clothing what? she gives him, Sybil, it's also different. I won't be long. So if you keep looking here, you'll see her change in the mirror and she'll react to that. Let's turn the TV on, like you know, she said. Time I had a guy in my apartment, it was summer. During the heat wave. Now it's winter. Freaky early, but still. Time flies. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, she's gone. Oh, hi. Zoom, yeah. <laughs> you can, she would react. Man. Yeah, I think you can look at the Bible. Oh, she's being weird. I wonder why. We can kill her if we want. She said green ones. We'll get her the red ones. The one that says... Ones that say, you know... Rat poison on them. She said in the bathroom? We came in from... Where's the bathroom? That's the kitchen. Does the flashlight in the face bother you? These apartments are really nice. That in Fahrenheit and Silent Hill. Shutter Memories. I do need the light. Look in the cabinet. Bottom shelf. Bottom shelf? Green ones. No, because I'm not a regular human. First of all, I'm twisting caps off backwards. Second, I have to... I'm not gonna put this back till I find the green one. So that would be silly, you know? That's how you do it at home, right? That's how everyone does. There we go, green. Wasn't there a memento here or something? Yeah, there, there's one. Infinite Jest. It's a ring and it says Ophelia on it. Again, Silent Hill 1 reference, which also comes from, uh, I forgot from where, in Silent Hill 1, it's in, it's in Nowhere. One of the keys you need to progress from Nowhere. Thanks. Water? No, fine. Self medication. <laughs> the one true perk of the healthcare profession. It's not just coffee that keeps us going 24 7. <laughs> she really likes talking okay. about it. I'm going to sleep now. You let yourself out. You feel guilty about everything. Oh, I love this one. Lived in huts this uh, exercise. Furs, we worried over the simple things. There you go, Joseph. Food, Answers. Water, whether animals would come and eat us in the night. Now we have supermarkets, bottled water, and 38 caliber home security. So what keeps us awake at night? More often than not, guilt. If only I had acted differently. If only I hadn't said that. If only I'd said something. You beat yourself up with your past. Don't blame yourself. Blame the world. Blame God. Blame me. You just can't. Okay, this is my favorite. Let it is my favorite too, man. Friends of mine. What? This is King Harold. His daughter, the chaste Celestine. A prince called Wilhelm. And a bull. He doesn't have a name. Prince Wilhelm is passionately in love with Celestine, but she does not love him. 
One day, Wilhelm comes to the king and asks for Celestine's hand in marriage. Celestine begs the king not to marry her to Wilhelm, but the king ignores her pleas. Royal protocol means he must say yes to the match. They are married, and Wilhelm takes Celestine back with him to his kingdom. That night, he attempts to consummate the marriage, but the distraught Celestine flees. She runs from the safety of the castle and across a field, ignoring the sign which warns of danger. In that field is a bull, who, seeing the girl, charges her. She falls under his hooves and is killed instantly. What I want you to do is line the players up according to how guilty they are of Celestine's death. Whose fault was it? At the left, most culpable. To the right, most innocent. You want to hear that again? Do you have a Do you have a preference, Mark? Or anyone else in the audience? From most guilty to least guilty for Cel Celestine's death. Yes, please tell me. Who is the most, who is the least, or right, let's start from most, who's the most guilty for her death in your eyes? All right, so we put her first. Then the king. Interesting. Then the prince, then the bull. Right, prince, and finally the bull. No. Don't fight, guys. Everyone gets there. So, girl, king, prince, bull. There you go. Done. Poor Celestine. She didn't have to run, right? I find the best cure for guilt is to never get caught in the first place. That was really good, Mark. Continue. <clears throat> so she's sleeping. We left her we left her in an excellent health. That was really good. Well you did, I think that's the best and the most true way. If you had different order he would comment on it. But this I think this just uh <laughs> this just confirms that, uh, you know, it was her responsibility the most, her life, regardless of everything else, because it's easy to put blame on other people. Oh, it's, we don't need the lights anymore. All right, so we got a waypoint which said go where. We got to go zoom out. We got to go to Simmons Street, so north there. Of course... I'm gonna take what I think is the shortest way. Yeah, let's go. Let's go this way. Again, it's one of those places where you got uh, where you can take two separate paths and have different results. So I'm just taking whichever, whichever is the closest. This one was the closest. I thought there would be a memento there. <laughs> what a chad shrink. <laughs> Oh, it can't go there, okay. Well, my bad. Oh, look, there's a... I think we can go there. There's a window there. Yeah. Shit. Can't see anything. Ah. Michelle. Hey, Harry. Michelle here. Hope you made it home okay. Still waiting for John. John? Some weekend. Ho ho. No, that's not what it says. <laughs> Let's photocopy our butt. Synthetic femur.
Well, this fell. What the hell is this? Well, this is also new to me, alright? So why did it fall? Was I supposed to steal some? Electronics? Alright, let's get to the mall. Huh, I thought she would... Am I going the right way? Okay, Silent Hill 3 reference, I can tell. Am I back where I started? Oh, for the love of fuck. That's why. <laughs> I went the wrong way. Alright. So what I did was basically went the other path. Yeah. Yeah? Wait, I gotta check. No, I'm not sure myself. Oh yeah, let's... F so remember these colors, if you can see them, because I can. It looks like blue pink red yellow man we're gonna have to find another one no actually i'm on the wrong i'm on the right path apparently nope no i'm not god damn it god damn it take the butt street all right all right mr butt i'll take the butt street if you say so i'll do it i'll do it for you mark It even looks, they made it look exactly like the mall in Sand Hill 3. What was it called? The something something mall. Mall entrance, alright. Okay, so, because I, I was in the wrong door. There, There's the entrance, look how big it is. Wink, wink. Safe Noir, new sale, new salon. Lisa, Lisa? I just left her sleeping. Yuri. Oh, Yuri. What's wrong? I don't feel well. I woke up. I had such a terrible dream. Blood everywhere. Try to stay calm, Lisa. I'm oh, coming. Oh, God, Harry. Please hurry. Now this music, the piano, love it. Oh, I'm coming back that way. The other way was actually closer, but fuck it, I'm already halfway through. I'm already halfway through. Gonna climb the stairs and save Lisa. Couldn't sleep five minutes without me. <laughs> Quickly. We gotta be quicker. She's not feeling well. If I remember where her apartment was, it was here. Yeah, there it is. Or was it straight ahead, right? Here we go. Get ready for uh, for for one of the bigger reveals. What were you Lisa? saying? I can't hear you from the blood. No. Don't move. No. This isn't what... I said don't move. Stand up and step away from the girl. This isn't what it looks like. Stop talking. What have you done? 
She was in an accident. I didn't do this. Accident? Shut the hell up. You've been feeding me bullshit all night. Oh, bastard. I didn't... Shut up! I know you're not Harry Mason. Every time he hears something, every time he gets a piece of the truth, the whole world goes to shit. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Apparently I'm not who I think I am. <laughs> we gotta get to the oh to the mall, but this this one this is the, the, the most tiring nightmare for me because uh well you'll see. Left or right, huh? Fuck it, I'm risking it with left. They're ahead of me. The flashlight can tell you if they're, you know, if you're looking in the monster's direction. Just ignore them. You fucking ignore them. Sprint, man, sprint. They're fucking chasing you. <laughs> Very relaxed for someone who's about to die. Whoa. Oh, they're 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 abstracting. Oh wow, that was lucky. There you go. That's what I need. There's the mole. We need the uh, two can colors, which I can't fucking remember what they were. Right, it's straight ahead of me, so are the monsters, so I gotta be careful. Oh shit, okay, flare time. Still to the left, I think. There's the colors. Purple, pink, red, yellow. Purple, pink, red, yellow. Purple, pink, red, yellow. We're gonna need that. It's gonna make my life a lot easier if I remember that. Throw it. It makes a blockade for them. I need to go right. Shit. So right from here. What the fuck are you doing behind me? I said it makes a blockade. Thank you. Thank you, Senpai. Thank you so much. I think that's the entrance. Quickly. Actually, to the left. Oh, yeah, there we go. I remember this. I gotta go down one of these. No, you don't. This is pretty useful to, to have a button to look behind you. I never used that as much as in this session. Oh, this is the last door, bitch. There you go. We'll be back as soon as we can, but we've got lots of shopping to do. Yes, I won't forget. Why are you shouting? Yes, she's here. Can I have some bubble gum? Sure. Here, sweetie. I can't buy your gum. Stop being ridiculous. No, I don't want those colors. I want my favorite colors. What are your favorite colors? I won't tell. Ah, it's a secret. Oh, she, she didn't say Two mom minutes. knows. I know the secret. I saw you looking up at Tuki. <laughs> right, Tuki. aren't I? Yes, my favorite. It's kind of bizarre because... Uh, <laughs> Harry Styles. Who's Harry Styles? I heard that name, but I don't know who he is. I know Ryan Styles, the comedian. <laughs> Harry Mason, but uh, so fun fact, <laughs> Tuki in Serbian, well, I'm pretty sure in Croatian as well, in Bosnian, it's a slang, one of the slangs for <laughs> female, for female, for male appendage, for, for, for a dick, for a Johnson, for a pecker, but it would be like, Tuki would be like, yeah, like pecker probably, would be the closest, so what was it, um, <clears throat> purple, pink, red, yellow, 
Oh, we have those. Let's try. Purple. Pink. Oh, pink? Really? All right, I guess. Red. And then yellow. Unless it's like backwards. Yep, that's it. <clears throat> Come on, let's go. We haven't got much time to shop. Why not? It's Saturday. Yeah, but we need to get back to help mom. Oh. Come on now. You know All right. Isn't true. Mom sucks, huh? Right, we're taking sides this time. You're gonna comment on it? I think I got him out of it. The experience. Welcome to Tol Kamal, home of the experience. Experience a world of... Sh oh, it's just like shopping. Live the experience. Yeah, I'm not gonna read that. Win a car. No, thank you. I need to win my daughter back. That got a... Um, We got separated in a car. Well, family pet, sure, that's a good one. Wasn't there, if I remember, there should be... Uh, first of all, we got this. It's a dead hamster. Bizarre, I know. Memories undeveloped. It's an underdeveloped film. You can imagine what he was doing while he was looking for an identical dog. Someone's kicking cans. Cheryl? Cheryl! Come back! She's off into a shutter. I can't go through walls, Cheryl. The experience, new message, store managers and retail staff. It's been another great mom, blah, 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 nothing in your person, just, yeah. Consumer, blah, blah, blah. I'm not gonna read that. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. It's, it's for the, oh yeah, I think we could, we could call the, the camera guy instead of reading that. I've just got to find the, his number somewhere here. We need Toluca Security. Toluca Security, 555-0207. I'm in the Toluca Mall. That place is closed down. It's empty. You can't be there. I am. I want to get out. We stopped doing security there a while ago. It's like is he's not in the right time calls? period. I need to get to Simmons Street. I need to get out. This is one of the guys on the other shift. You think I'm stupid? Huh. Okay. If you're in the mall, how come I can't see you on the monitors, huh? How come you didn't trip any alarms? See? Not so stupid. It's not a joke. You guys. Oh my god, he... It's like he's in a nightmare. The entire game. It's like when you're trying to run, but you can't. You're running, but you're not moving. We gotta crack a safe. Did it work? No. There we go. My flying lizard. 
again one of the well the very very first enemy you see in the first Silent Hill bef right after the intro <laughs> But, you know, like all these things are there because, well, they would have made the Silent Hill in the original game. Alright, we need a key. What if without, without the lamp? No, he always turns it on. Okay. So it goes like that. I'm just gonna go in circles. But we need it to turn, so... Move the, tra move the switch track and... What a puzzle. Man, I don't know if I could have ever solved this. <laughs> Going up. There now. Uh huh. Junk, junk, junk. Mannequin. There's so much knowledge of the lore in this game. Oh, we have an echo. Dookie music. Let's find it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I love this one. Harry? After yeah. this. John turned up, finally. I wanted to see how you were doing. We can hear the car. No. Almost. Um, got held up. Bad things keep happening. Sorry, Harry. What was that? What's happening? Uh, nothing. I'll be there soon. Sorry, Harry. You're breaking up. We're going into a tunnel. Have to speak later. Was it here? No. It'll, it'll show me. Oh, there we go. Some rubbish. There it is. Family pet. Check out my dog. He's so clever. I've only had him for an hour, but he already knows my voice and I taught him a trick. I've named him Chip. And look, it's the house we painted at the beginning of the game. Is it? No, we painted it green. Oh, it didn't. But it's the house. The... Simmons Street, right? Levin Street? The first one. Alright, let's go to... Uh, why, why not? To a photo shop. Twenty one today. Hope you get as drunk as I was when I thought this bought this crappy card. Fifty today. Twenty one fifty. Congratulations on your half century. Best wishes for the next fifty. Oh, that's cute. 20th wedding anniversary. Oh. Wish you all the. I don't know, something loving, lovingness in the world. Enjoy your. something of your special day. Right? Yeah. What you'd expect. One heart. Oh man, I can't read that. At this good time, treasure like memories hold them. I think it's in the music, actually. So, uh, what was that code again? Yeah, I know you told me. I got a lot to remember. Things than jazz. Alright, strings than jazz. Alright, you gotta figure out what's playing where. There's cheers. One of them has strings. I think it was the anniversary one. 
50 is jazz. So it's 2050, okay. Cheryl! What is that? Uh -huh. The experience. Yeah, I haven't lifted a finger all afternoon. A lot of the store was closed so they could take photos in there. For marketing. I don't know why they even need to be in there. Why they can't just computer the whole thing or whatever. They weren't real customers, models and actors, I guess. And the food, the food they showed was like all brought in special. It was sprayed with a spritzer to make it look tasty. Cheryl, come back to me. I made you a muffin. How do I climb in this special place? Yeah, that's the one I was... I said, I'm gonna like this. Problem child. Another profitable day at the mall. Today I bagged myself. Nice top, memory cards, two CDs, bunch of books, pair of jeans, three DVDs. Was spotted in the last store by that guard. I looked all innocent and just walked past him, but I think he knew. <clears throat> yeah, me too, love. Me too. There's the second part of that. <clears throat> There's someone sitting there crying next to the cones. Sir, who is bleeding? Can you describe the situation? The security guard, Malcolm, has been stabbed. He's dead. Are you sure he's dead? Is he breathing? Oh God, she just went crazy. She was spitting and screaming. Oh, it's not right. Malcolm would never hurt a fly. She just went insane. So, uh, in Silent Hill Three, I think this is. This is pointing at Silent Hill 3 because, well, at the start of the game, you could have one of the weapons you could use is the pocket knife and uh, as Cheryl, Heather, and uh, at one point, the one of the characters does tease you, what, what, what monsters are you talking about? You think they're monsters? You've been killing people all this time, so uh, I think that's what that's about. All right, cinema, show me what I need to see. It's from the from the main menu. Oh, we're starting the game. I see myself. That's weird. All right, all right. We're gonna get a, an interesting ending, I think. Dahlia again. Miss you, Harry. Miss your touch, your kiss, your smell. Triple X, Daria. Daria? <laughs> Dahlia. <laughs> Right, we're back outside. Should be close to where I need to be, I think. And there should be a third part of the family pet story. There it is, I see it.
But it's interesting if you replay this game and you make some choices different, even the stories you know will be told in a different way. That's a lot of it fit in less than four gigabytes, you know. Where is it here? Here. Something something run over by the car before. I told you to keep your eyes on the road. If we hadn't been arguing, I would have. I think we hit something. You can't drive and talk? I suppose that would be asking too much. Oh, shit. What now? We hit a dog. A dog? Not just any dog. Yep, different. Again, different. I'm, I'm gonna have to check this. Green Lion Pawn Shop. Again. <laughs> Location from the first game. Such a good retelling. Oh, look, it's the... Fucking lionesses from Outbreak. This is where they came from. I should have known from Sun Hill all, all along. You gotta get what a, the worst security system in the in the world. <laughs> all right, I found my home. Apparently, you're ready for this. It's gonna be really interesting. And another. Um, Another bomb is going to be dropped on Mason's head. Oh wow, I forgot about that. I I completely forgot about the IP switch. That's how engrossed in this game I am. Jeez. Are we live? We should be live, yeah. Alright. There's Tuki. Look at that, it's the girl from the cover. It only took a minute. Like, really? A whole minute? Cheryl? Where have you been? It's been hours. Did you get my pills? Cheryl! Pills? Oh my god, she's old. Hello. You here for my daughter? Harry? <laughs> How do you know me? Where's Cheryl? Still at the lighthouse, maybe. Lighthouse? What are you doing here, Harry? Uh, looking for Cheryl. Isn't this my house? Who are you? You look really good. Who are you? We're soulmates, you and I. From She's so much older than him. Horror, in sickness and in health. You're my wife? Why does every time I learn something, everything goes to shit? Alright, the nowhere of Sand Hill Shattered Memories. Uh, quite a few, if not every Sand Hill game has a nowhere. Which is what it sounds like. And it's gonna be real trippy. And this one is my second favorite Nowhere. My all-time favorite Nowhere is in Silent Hill 1. And this one is really good. Not as good, but really good. Alright. Here we go. Everything's frozen. She looks just like on the cover. With the ice and everything. <laughs> That's just natural to leave in this situation. Uh, I'm sure the stairs were like this when I got in. We're gonna steal a little from Silent Hill 2 in a second with the symbolics. Look at the size of that thing. Here we go. Long way down, and you can see how shit's deformed. And the stairs are everywhere where they shouldn't be. It's should, supposed to be the reflection of the soul. Yeah, this is what I meant from Silent Hill. You see a hole, you let, you're like, "Fuck, I'm gonna jump into it." <laughs> <clears throat> mm -mm. 
Oh, look, it's it was my photo. Me hugging my daughter. All right. I lost her, huh? Boo. All right, gotta find my way. Now I do need a flashlight, because uh, I gotta find my way out of here. I should be looking for a light, but I can't know. I don't know exactly which one. This one? Yeah, it is. Oh, it's okay now. Now I coughed well and I'm good. The living room? Now I gotta get a, get out of here. Does this help me? No. Just gonna go straight and see what happens. Oh, keep going ever deeper. <laughs> it would be. The mirror. You can't see yourself in the mirror the entire game. I don't know if you noticed that. If you have been paying attention. Oh shit. I gotta find the right way now. Oh my god, they're... Oh my god, the final level. There it is. I think. I gotta find the ones that are freezing over. Are the ones I need to go to. Can't see shit. I think you just run actually at this point. Oh, bye. Why do I think that would work? Oh, God. Oh! Try it without the flashlight, huh? I'm gonna go this way. Oh, damn. Are they gonna down me? No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. It's the bedroom this time. There's something in the wall. Two roses? Symbolic. Now it's all twisted. Now I'm on the side of the bedroom. Now I'm upside down in the bedroom. No, the living room. Now I'm back in the living room. But no TV. With static. And two doors missing. Now the TV's on. Does it show something? No. That's from the main menu when we're starting the game. So creepy the way she repeats, I love my daddy. Still upside down? Yeah, you do. She, she, I, I get, I, I bet she's really sad that she missed this. More falling. Whee! Car, getting into car. Outside the car on the ground from where we started the game and it just loops. Both entering, he puts her in. Then one frame of him in the snow. You think so, huh? Oh, watch out, she might be lurking. Right now we gotta find a way outside of this dark cage. Just follow the light, don't... 
Don't focus on the dark. We gotta get to that bed over there. We gotta get there. We gotta have some human touch. Just the way we left her. Drunkenly lurking. Yeah, there we go. Still going, huh? Fuck me. Alright. Now we're looking for the ice. Now I'm looking. We'll always look for the door with the ice and you won't go wrong. This way. And it gets more and more frozen. Ice. Fuck off, Screecher. Another far away door. I think this is it. We're done with nowhere. We're so close to the end of the game. Just a few more minutes. Let it go. Cheryl. This is He's remembering. That's so sad. That sentence always felt heavy. This is your room, but you're not in it. It's so tragic. He's so tired after all of this. You know, I think we're getting somewhere. We're all tied up in this marriage thing. Marriage worked a lot better when we didn't live so long. We have phrases like the honeymoon is over to remind us how quickly marriage is sour. You think I'm being cynical? Divorce does that to you. Come on. You think marriage can really last? You can look at his booze as well. Yeah, I think so. Should a couple stay together for the kids? I'm gonna answer the opposite of usual. Yes. Do you think it's a bad idea to marry young? Yes, you I'm very prudent. You think sex becomes stale after marriage? Oh yeah. Well, you see, I'm 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 also divorced. You, know what? <laughs> you being such an expert on marriage, you're going to ace my matchmaker test. On the table are six pictures. All you have to do is sort them into three married couples. All right, so I'm going to speed this up. Mark, you want to choose? So as you can see, they have some of them have the same backgrounds and some of them have the same clothing. So what would you connect? The one with the same background as couples? Or the ones with the same clothing as couples? That would be, I don't know. This, I guess. Oh, sorry, I don't know what it is. What's what? One plus two. I took this one from here. Man, I fucked it up. Didn't expect that. She was from here. One plus one, two plus three. Oh, couple one is right. Okay. 2 plus 3, so this was 3, no, it was 3 plus 2, alright, 3 plus 2, and 2 plus 3, you didn't duck up, stop fucking up, <laughs> uh, there you go, so he wants, you want to sort them by the backgrounds, I see, alright, I, if that's your choice, I mean, Everyone can lead their lives if you really want it that way. <laughs> uh. All finished. Okay. Now tell me which of those couples are still together. <laughs> I'm joking. You know I'm just trying to provoke you, right? 
Oh, let's keep going. We're really making progress here. That's a good one. That's actually a good one, Mark. Harry? 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 Were you dreaming? H for Harry. Are you okay? What are you doing here? This place is... Your home, right? I saw the photos of you in the corridor, you and your family. Cheryl isn't here. I'm sorry. The woman said Cheryl was at the lighthouse. Let's the go lighthouse to the lighthouse. Closed down years ago. Now I need to go there. John and I can drive you there. We'll take the lake road. Thank you. Harry, this is John. John, Harry. Hey, Michelle says you kept her company earlier when I was late. Thanks. Good to meet you. Harry? Yeah, <laughs> Sasha. Sasha's doing the Team America World Police. Gary? Harry <laughs> got John. I always wanted one of these. But when Cheryl was born, we graduated to the family car club. Trunk space wins out over engine size. I'd swap the car for a family any day. Though I'm happy enough with just John for now. Cut it out, Michelle. Huh? It's embarrassing. Uh, I'm not embarrassed. Don't mind me. This isn't how I wanted things to go. It's not Harry's fault. I Nothing mean... Nothing to do with Harry. I mean this. Us. I wanted to make things clear. Oh, it's awkward. I'm just gonna right. look through the window. This reunion. This weekend. Well, maybe just... I wanted to come see you to talk things through. Talk? Give me out. our relationship? Michelle, there is no relationship. Guys, I'm here. Not now. If not now, when? Where? Christ, Michelle, I've been trying to do this for months. But you don't want to hear it. Now we have a witness. Maybe you'll listen. You're just tired. You're not thinking right. It's been too long since we've been together. No. No, Michelle. I was hoping to do this right. But I need to do it. We've been running on empty for a long time. Living on fumes. It isn't a relationship, it's a courtesy. I still love you. It can't be over. It is. You don't love me. You love the John in your head. It's heavy stuff they're tackling here. I can't listen to this. I can't do this anymore. You just stop in the middle of the road and get out? Uh, me, guys? Michelle, you good? Why did I call her Cynthia? John. Because of some... Guys? Well, don't mind me, I'll just help myself, I guess. We're just gonna check your glove box because you were so insolent. And take your no. I want your memento. Wrong button. That's a memento, isn't it? No. Why do we keep pressing down? There you go. Poetry as precise as geometry. And it's got a writing. But I'm not going to read it because, uh, well, I got to turn it properly to read it. Everything one invents is time. I guess I'll just get out. They left me here. How rude. Alright guys, just need a very short break, gotta uh, run to the bathroom, I'm not even gonna put the be right back screen on, it looks good paused like this, so I'll be right back, don't go anywhere, we're finishing this in the next 10-15 minutes. Wow. Leave it to Sasha to just like call me out <laughs> outright, call me out outright, 10 minutes, yeah, 10-15 minutes, you don't believe me? Just watch this, Missy. State water. We're going this way, well, 30 minutes. That's 15 minutes of playtime and 15 minutes of cutscenes. <laughs> you didn't mention 45 minutes. That's what we all uh, call a happy bit. <laughs> I'll be with you in a hippie bit. From Dahlia. Sorry about last night. I guess I scared you off.
two and a half hippie bits are almost equal to one mark minute. Yeah, that's like it's like conversion from uh, imperial to uh, metric, you know. It's a fish. Look at its bones. Disgusting. <laughs> a happy bond. It's a ring. Yeah, we can check the mementos at any time we open this box and all the mementos we collect. There's a lot more of them, but I missed... <laughs> I missed a lot of them on purpose. I didn't want to... You know, I didn't want to go around and collect all of them. I think in the last stream we got every last one. Or if there were some missing, it was like one or two. Cheryl? You're the one I'm looking for. Not safe. Like everything so far was safe. But it, it really, I really want to joke. He's missing the fish, yeah. Is he working today? I think he's working today. No, he was working when we streamed last. What was that, Thursday? Could be working today or tomorrow. King's beer. Oh, there's the light. So they said Cheryl was at the lighthouse. So let's go towards the light. Oh, look. Another memento. Memories untaken. It's an Insta camera. And a cigar box. Where is that? Over here. There's something here, but like I said, I'm not gonna read all the stories this time. It's just a bare bones. Where is it? Is that so, love? Day trippers. That's why we saw the fish in there. There's the light from the lighthouse. We need to go that direction. We can even see it in the map. So, we, we've been through the entire city now in one sitting. But there's the lighthouse. Almost where we started. Gotta get to the other coast somehow. Wait, where, where do I go? I go in here, right? Should be a door, yeah, all right. It's Annie's bar, right? I think it's Annie's. No, it's not, okay, but it's soon. Annie's bar is soon. A lot of mementos in this part. Like I said, whenever he learns something important, shit hits the fan. A beacon, a key, huh? And I'm just looking for a lighthouse. What are the chances of that? down no never nothing there so why is this part even here I think this is where Annie's is there we go Annie's bar again from the first game I said that so many times tonight but yeah Hold it.
your diamond heart. And inside it, it says, journey's end and love's meeting. Sun Hills, Lighthouse Cove, Scenic Views. Good call, 555-2628, but we're not gonna. Let's see what's up with Annie's. Hey. It's over, John and me. You guys also went through the sewer? in love with an idea of this person but that wasn't John yeah what a waste you know I should have realized when he said he wanted to be a lawyer you're still headed for the lighthouse Ugh. yeah it gets heavy now to cross the lake they often moor at the jetty behind the amusement park head through the alley out back you'll see it I used to go there with John I doubt it's as exciting as I remember it are you sure you want to go, Harry? It's all I got. Something feels wrong. She's there. I know it this time. I'll get my answers. You might not like them. And that's the last he ever saw. No, yeah. <laughs> We're getting deep in it now. I can almost taste it. All this talking, and we still haven't touched on the sex thing. No thanks, I ate. <laughs> That's what you're thinking. Aren't all psychiatrists supposed to be obsessed with sex? It's not us. It's you. You're obsessed with sex. Even when we're not talking about it, you're thinking about it. Well, now I am. <laughs> Come on. Let's have some Nah, See like I said, I on the table. I want you to divide them up. The ones you think Mark. are sexual symbol go on the left. The ones that aren't, the right. Which one of these are sexual symbols, huh? We got some... Um... I'm going to order them, and then if you want to pick... You can just say one, two, three, four. Not sexual. See what they were going at for here? One, yes. Two, no. All right, no. One, yes. Two, no. Three, yes. All of these pictures look like my mother. <laughs> Four. <laughs> Four, no, all right. Five. <laughs> What's he going to say for five? No. Six. Yes. Very sexual. And finally, seven. That's a penis. <laughs> seven is a no. All right. Huh, you got more no than yes. Interesting. Done. Good. Of course, the constant partner of sex, the other side of the same coin, is... Death. Car. Wow, that's new. Usually it shows something else, doesn't Sex it? Is death. It's a leap into the void. The great loss of self. The tiger in space. A plea for annihilation. To deny sex is to deny death itself. You know, people who are getting enough don't need analysis. You clearly are not getting enough. Whoa, whoa there, Doc. Let's see this through to the end. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, just like, of course. 
Uh, lighthouse, come to me. Anything there? Nah. No. I don't care. I just need to go to the lighthouse. Cheryl! Cheryl! Oh, obviously not there. Wait, maybe yes? Gotta look for a boat. There should be more in here. Oh, I was on the right track, alright? When you doubt yourself unnecessary. No, actually this way, huh? If this turns out to be where I came from, it would be funny. No, I don't think so. Is it though? Yeah, this is where I came from. <laughs> Isn't that funny? <laughs> to left. No, it's not left. It's gotta be this way. Wait, is it where I came from? Very hard to judge. Amusement park. All right, let's go in there. Nothing bad ever happens in the amusement park, right? It's almost a point-and-click game to a to a level, which again. You know, it really doesn't bother me. It's a really interesting approach to the same um, material. All right, we're going to see the main thing from the title screen. Now, Mark wasn't there for the start, but he'll get it regardless, especially in the ending. There we go. There are two faces in there. They look like me and Cheryl, but interestingly, if you do it here as well, you can see them. And you can see it's Harry in his Hawaiian shirt and little Cheryl. Because once you take a picture, you can see the ghost world, you know, through your phone. Music in this game really is really appropriate, you know? For the atmosphere and everything, it blows my mind sometimes. Let's do some gambling. Three hearts. Give us an Eve pendant. And is that face familiar? Or what? If you don't press anything, it takes him longer. We first kissed in the tunnel of love. Tunnel of love. Yeah, that's what it says. Yeah, that's why I turned it off. Why does he have to kill the dragon? I was gonna eat the princess. Maybe he was hungry. Maybe she was a bad princess. Knights save princesses. That's how it works. Guess. Oh, we missed that one. Right, we gotta find more disturbances. 
There she is. Follow that shadow kid. There she goes. I didn't see where she went, but we'll find her. Because the flashlight reacts to her. I mean, again, it's different. It's a different one. What a cute nope. Oh, because, uh, because, yeah, she looks horrifying, yeah. And the sound she makes. 52, 53. Alright, that's the boat. Here we go, the final moments. If it weren't 10 minutes before, it is now. Whole lot of story, and you know it'll all start making sense. Final fifty-five minutes. That's right, love. That's right. I gotta get late so I don't have to go get the analysis, whatever he called it. So she has like Harry Mason, several different looks late. she can have. For what? And we got this one of all of them. You, so you're playing catch up. What is this place? It's a boat. It's like a car, but goes on water. We float this baby out into the middle of the lake, and we can do whatever we like. No one to tell us what to do. I need to get to the lighthouse. Well, it can do that too. For a price. My daughter is there. I need to be there. Harry, Harry, always with the weight of the world on his shoulders. I remember when you were a fun-loving guy. We're talking about my daughter, damn it! Okay, okay. That was easy. Just a little to the left and a button. in about 20 minutes it's a slow boat you know what's happening to me I know a lot of things you don't know the half of it I've seen you die I've seen a woman with the same name twice your age she said she was my wife every step I take Cheryl gets further away but now she's at the lighthouse nowhere else to go they all seem to like they know something everyone except for for him There go, no therapy needed after that. We don't need to take the clothes off. We can do it through them. And that was Silent Hill Shadow Memories. Good game. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I'm glad you looked it up. I wouldn't be surprised. I wouldn't be surprised about her especially. Man, I didn't make a single save the entire game. That's the that's the first. I just played through it. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, the Hawaiian shirt from the amusement park and from the title screen. Senpai! Oh, my controller turned off because of the cutscene. Alright, it's time. We gotta get to the lifehouse. Lifehouse? Lighthouse? Everything's frozen. You gotta do it yourself, Harry. Just run to the light. Harry, come back! 
It's too late now. I need you, Harry. I'm glad you have, man. It's too late now. Can't come back. I'm sorry. Man, it's so much... <laughs> Alright, so you wouldn't fall asleep for the ending? Um... <laughs> Harry's stylish. <laughs> A message from Sybil. This your little Cheryl? Portland Police Department. A nod to Sun Hill 3 again. That can't be her. She's, she was five when we were in the car. Thank you, Senpai. For not your favorite Silent Hill, that really means a lot. They're everywhere! I've never done a run where I just look for her, which is what I'm doing now. I barely looked at anything else. But we still got weird enemies, so I'm wondering if we're gonna get that creepiest of endings. They're everywhere! Yeah, yeah, I get it, I get it. You gotta press both buttons if there's two of them on you. Leave me alone, you boys! didn't work I'm out of strength uh, they're gonna get me goodbye cruel world they're all touching me stop touching me yeah really DSLs <laughs> but it's a different kind of scary love. Dicks. <laughs> I never heard that term, man. <laughs> I've never heard that term. There you go, with you, with the two of you. Wait, why are you gonna tell me in Evil Dead? We look down, we can see Harry with Dahlia on the bed. <laughs> Holding her. Like a snow covered virgin. I'm too impure. There they are. I wonder what Joe's doing, fall asleep <laughs> throughout this. Man, almost four hours. Well, less, actually. Because uh, there's always the startup time, but yeah. Well, look, it's the scene from the beginning. The car's crashed and Harry's on the ground. I'm sure it doesn't mean anything. It's like X square, X square. That's how you go forward. There you go, finally I'm at the lighthouse. I'm dying here. He's just sleeping, yeah. I do that too sometimes, I just lay down in snow. You know, with my face toward the ground and I just na take a nap. It's the, it's it's good for building immunity. Especially if I just open the, the front door of my car, I just... Yeah. Come on, I'm almost there, don't give up now, you pussy. Go, go, go. You're there, come on, you can do it. Hey, do it. Uh, go, 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 go. Oh. <laughs> Senpai. <laughs> I gotta say SWAT Sybil is pretty cool. I got the I got the I don't know what to call her. Horny Sybil and regular Sybil quite a few times, but this one only once I think. Not 
not stopping me. I'm not here to stop you. I didn't have to fish you out of the water, did I? Stop talking! You can't talk me out of this! I'm not here to stop you! I pulled your file at the station. I told you that, right? If you're telling the truth, this doesn't make sense. But I think you are telling the truth. I believe you think you're Harry Mason. Hell, I believe you are Harry Mason. But Harry Mason was killed in a car crash 18 years ago. You want answers? I guess they're waiting in there. That's the lighthouse. She came to help him. Nothing's quite what you expect, is it? First thing tomorrow, I'm gonna hand in my badge. I don't think I'm cut out for police work. Not in this town. Good luck. Thanks. Well, yeah, I'm not gonna say anything until the until the very last moment, because it's gonna it's gonna be sweeter revealed than me tell, talking about it. But yeah, here we are. We're at the lighthouse. Yeah, it's a different Silent Hill. That's that's what I said when I said they they made it fresh. Lighthouse Clinic. Yeah, it's a clinic with by M. Kaufman, M.D. Michael Kaufman. It's strange, like that psychiatrist we've been seeing the entire game. And this music, geez, it just gives me chills right away. Let's open up his brain, and we'll find Adam, the other side of that pendant. And look, he's got Harry's face. So we got both Harry and Dahlia as Adam and Eve. Are you ready, Mark? This is gonna be something, and uh, I didn't expect it the first time. Until I was walking down this hallway, I was like, holy shit, I, I think I know what's happening. This is going nowhere. I'm it's gonna be so trippy. Out, but you're not listening. Your troubled school days? How you're conflicted about marriage? Your denial of death? The unfounded guilt? Abnormal sexuality? 18 years of I love this denial, scene. a whole universe of fantasy in that thick skull of yours, a skull teeming with agents of repression, blind children clutching photos in the dark, pale freaks goggle-eyed from watching home movies on loop. The term is complicated grief, but it's simple, isn't it? A young girl. Her parents don't get along. She blames herself, as all children do. Then daddy dies. What's a girl to do? Deny that daddy died. Deny who daddy was. What seven-year-old actually knows who their parents are anyway? So she obsesses and obsesses over this fantasy dad propping up her make-believe with scraps, scraps of a happy life that never was, all the mementos. of a father who never existed, Wake up! Such a good scene. Your dad wasn't a hero. He wasn't your knight in shining armor. He was a human being. You never knew him. And you never will. The dad walking around in your head isn't even a ghost. He never existed. A Frankenstein's monster, a child's fantasy. But you're alive. Your mother is alive. She's not the monster you make her out to be. You need to live your life. Cheryl. So fucked up. You've been with me for so long. I always will be. It does, doesn't it? And that's the title screen I was talking about, Mark. That's where you select the new game and all that. Why, why the whole game is like a videotape.
Let's see which ending we got. You piece of shit. Oh no. Bring in some real money. You think you're crap Shakespeare? Your piece of shit novels? No one even reads them. Be a man. Come on, fight back. I'm pathetic. To think I used to hang off your every word. Dickless waste of space. Yeah. The first one. So it's, I think this one's called The Weak and the Wicked. Interesting ending for what we did. Oh my god, it never gets... It never get, it never, it's never not hard, no matter how many times you go through this game. But yeah, we got the calm ending again, the calm music. But yeah, that was, um, <laughs> that was, that was Silent Hill Shadow Memories for you. As always, it's... It's an amazing story, with not so amazing power. Yeah, didn't expect this one. Wish Laura Bailey would slap me. <laughs> and you get a diagnosis, which if you like, if you do the things the way you do them, it's pretty spot on about your personality. I've had this with a few friends, even those who did don't play games, because it's such a short game. I had them play it, and they were like, "Holy shit, that's really creepy." Yeah. Yeah. She's pretty popular. <laughs> but yeah, so the ending itself, there's more after the credits, but yeah, ending itself, uh, there's four variations, or six, I think, variations on the, the main ending, but then there's many variations on this diagnosis itself and the scene that comes after that. You saw that mutation you were following? So yeah, that's why we love Sun Hill. Oh yeah, Mary Elizabeth is just... Yeah, she's amazing. Well, thank you, Joe. It's a real important game to me. It does kind of look like Portal. But man, in the... I'm glad, Joe. I guess there's a point. But yeah, it's building a psych report based on what we <laughs> what we chose. So next time in the you know in the actual marathon, we'll do it um, for a specific ending because we're gonna do the next endings in Sun Hill at some point. <laughs> but yeah, this this was really good. What a libation! A very sensitive soul prides itself on being kind and on enjoying life as it comes. <laughs> Oh yeah, there's gonna be a lot of uh, Silent Hill marathons, of course. Not not right now. This is just like April Fools. Isn't it a funny game <laughs> for April Fools? I was gonna do something completely different, an actually funny game, but funny for all the wrong reasons. And uh, this morning I get up and I was like, you know what? No, yesterday morning I got up and I thought I'm actually gonna play Silent Hill: Shadow Memories tomorrow. Yeah, a lot of stuff I didn't know. <laughs> I've been fooled by Harry's existence. <laughs> I mean, this one's called uh, Acceptance. And it plays in the endings where she accepts his death. In the ones where she doesn't, I think the scariest one is, yeah, the scene with the two of them is different, along with the ending itself, what we just saw, the weak and the wicked. So uh, there are endings where she doesn't accept his death and she goes on with the illusion. <laughs> and in that, in those endings, my second favorite track from this soundtrack, or maybe like the the, the favorite track, I'm think I'm gonna say, Hell Frozen Rain, Rain plays. So we'll get that sometime. It's a really good track, along with the opening, uh, when you're gone. And these these lyrics from especially from the opening one they they have a totally I like how they did it you think one thing when you first see it and everything and then once you beat the game you understand the meaning what they actually wanted to say with it and I I like that just like how the game there are the mementos
and his picture on the table. That's really powerful, man. I wish I wish Climax made more games. Yeah, I mean, after all of this, wouldn't you want to? Just like the game knows... Um, I forgot what I was going to say, man. It's just... <laughs> I'm feeling a lot of emotion right now. <laughs> Do we get anything new? Nah. I forgot what I was going to say, but... Um, it had something to do with the ending. It doesn't matter. I'm tired and this was... Wow. GG, guys. Thanks for watching. All of you. Lovely people. Senpai. Man, I know it's late. And you're up. Thank you. Joseph. On a Saturday morning with your friend. Thank you. <laughs> and Mark. It's nice knowing you, man. <laughs> I was doing. You. I was doing Sergeant. <laughs> and Caboose. <laughs> <laughs> when he gives the big speech and he says goodbye to everyone, like, what are, uh, what are we here for? It's like in the eighth season. <laughs> they already been through crap. And he says all this. It's like, uh, you, you're here for because of that. And you here. And Caboose, good, good seeing you here. Yes, I am enjoying the speech. <laughs> Let's see who we can raid. I'm going to go uh, eat something, get to bed, and then... As soon as I get up, I'll nod you for, uh, for Evil Dead, Joe. Brown should be there, too. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Why not? Michelle. Let's raid Michelle. It's been a few days. Haven't seen Michelle. The, the top Twitch host, I'm going to say. Michelle, Michelle Sui. A Swedish Resident Evil Silent Hill. No damage. Uh, no save streamer. really pleasant host to <laughs> to be in stream for oh nice mark great oh wonderful guys wonderful <laughs> that's really good alrighty thanks again lovely session like best april fools ever <laughs> all the tears were shed so good night senpai have a great day uh joe uh, good night mark good night everybody everywhere <laughs> as winnie pooh once said bye. see you in the next week bye <laughs>